Hello fluffy people of the world, my name is Liquid Blitz and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. Okay, so we're going to be getting back to the triple slap to the balls, the, the, the triple sentinels. But before we do, um, first of all I think I'm going to start off this episode by going human. We're going to start off with the best possible chance. Okay, so thanks for the tips and whatever for the... Uh, and just feedback and comments from the last episode. A um, little bit mixed feelings about, about some of the feedback. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I know about the binoculars and the fact that they can basically let you aim your spells. And I even know exactly where to get it. Um, I've thought about how to open this episode and talk about spoilers, but I think, you know, we've, we've talked about it enough. Uh, suffice it to say that sometimes the feedback can be a little on the side of spoilers to the point where I know exactly where the binoculars are and what they do and in my mind that's a little bit of a spoiler so I I'm not going to sit here and start talking about it at length I'm just going to say please be careful with the feedback and try not to be too like telling me exactly give giving me the answer and telling me what's what do you know what i mean maybe hint at things but some people just just straight up told me what the binoculars are where they are i don't even know if they were in this game do you know what i mean so please be careful going forwards um but anyway sort of separately to that i just logged in today and genuinely just i just i was running around making sure i got the controls all you know Shaking off the cobwebs. And I actually saw that item there. You see that? It's hard to see. It's above my head, right there. And I wasn't looking for that. I, I was just making sure the controls were, like, not fucked. Um, etc. And I actually saw that. So I'm figuring that might be the binoculars right there. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to spe speak any more about spoilers. Other than asking you to kind of be careful with your feedback. I've been inching towards maybe not reading comments for the rest of the playthrough, I'll be honest. It's sort of getting close to that because some of the feedback is... It's its all of you guys trying to be helpful, and, and I appreciate that, especially the quality of life things and, uh, like, extra bits of info about some stats and things like that, but when I'm directly given an answer or told where something is and what it does, yeah, most of you get it. I'm not, I'm not going to sit here and lecture you. Most of you get it. Um, but um, there is there is a point where you're being a bit too helpful. Right, yeah, clearly I can see you've got to jump down here. Um, let me know how you feel. Should, should I just not read comments for the rest of the playthrough? Because, uh, yeah, I'm trying to play through Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3 blind and... Oh, ooh, there's two items. Hello there. Morning Star and Cleric's Sacred Chime. Okay. Morning Star, Cleric's Sacred Chime. Let's read both of those. But yeah, you can, you can ask until the end of time for people not to post spoilers. They always will. It's just, it's a sad reality of YouTube uh, feedback, um, you know. And a lot of it, it's funny. Talking about spoilers, there aren't necessarily any individual people posting straight up spoilers. A lot of it is actually uh, um, what happens when you get multiple people giving helpful hints. But once you read all of those comments, they can form an amalgam that is then a spoiler. Does that make sense? So even if you are trying to be careful with the spoilers, posting anything that's even remotely sort of helpful or like a hint and then four other people do the same about the same topic, suddenly all of them together, then you've got a spoiler and I, I straight up know an answer to something. So even just posting hints can turn into a spoiler, whether you want them to or not. I will just say, if there's any doubt in your mind that, that if, if there is a chance I will learn something on my own in the rest of the playthrough, probably best to just not post it, you know what I mean? Um, but I'm not going to say anything else about it. Spoiler talk over. Right, were they two weapons I just got? The cleric's thing sounds like a weapon. Morning star, right. I didn't use much in the way of sort of strike weapons in the first game. 
Um, mostly because I didn't like the move set of the maces in Dark Souls 1. A club fitted with a spiked head. The spikes of this blunt weapon cause bleeding, normally wielded by clerics. That's making me think of the clerics in Game of Thrones, the ones with like a spiky club that try and hit the mountain in the chest and it does nothing. Da -da 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 -da, to draw blood, okay. I wonder if strike works the same way in this game, that it's it's strong against armored enemies like the 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 three lanky streaks of piss? Maybe? Ooh. I didn't consider that. Ooh, cleric's sacred chime. Oh, it's a, a spell thing. Just like mine. Ooh. Oh. Hang on, let's read it. Most clerics receive this as their first and sacred uh, first sacred chime. A catalyst for miracles and hexes. That's sorceries and hexes, that's miracles and hexes. Ah to use miracles, equip a sacred chime and attune a miracle at a bonfire. Right, I see. So that's faith and miracles. Okay. Okay. Well at least we've got one now. That's our first miracle caster. Now is this the uh the fabled binoculars it is. Okay. Well, okay. I should I should have figured myself this was here after seeing this little ledge here. I remember in episode one, I think, there was some blood pools here showing people trying to jump onto there. Uh so I should have known. And I should have seen the items as well. Let's give that a little read. Uh, inventory. It was really helpful in the first game, actually. The binoculars. Where are they? Uh, is it not? Oh, there. It's a weapon. <laughs> it's a weapon. Can I club someone with some binoculars? Binoculars are used to peer at distant sites, equip in place of a weapon to use. Oh, that's different. It was in your Estus flask slot in the first game. These won't help you in battle. Are you sure about that? Because people have told me otherwise. But with a little creativity can be put to good use. Okay, well let's try throwing that on. So it needs a slot. I mean, I've got a third slot. Does it weigh anything? Because I'm right at my 70 equip load limit here. It does. I'm still under 70%. Okay. Huh. Well, I'm guessing here I can throw it in my right hand and have the sorcery thing in my left hand. So I can sort of already see why people suggest this. Light attack. And he okay, both the attack keys do the same thing. Oh. Yeah, I liked it in the first game just because it literally let you see, like, spots better, you know? Uh. Yeah. Okay. So hang on, if I... Can you just aim on the binoculars? If you see what I'm saying. I kind of figured when people were telling me, okay, get the binoculars, it helps you aim spells. Um, I was thinking maybe you could... It, it might have been like a cheese thing where you sort of aim with your binoculars and then wherever you let go and then cast a spell, it would happen to go exactly where you were looking. But I didn't consider you might be able to fire a spell in the actual view of the binoculars. Um. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> okay. There's no crosshair, but I can guesstimate the center of my monitor. Let's, let's put this to the test. The tip of Orthanc is right in the middle of my monitor. Basically. I mean, fuck. <laughs> That's pretty much in the center. Okay. Okay. Um, right, before we get to the shit as well, I thought uh, of maybe equipping the Van... The Varangian armor, because it's significantly better physical. I lose a little, a teeny tiny bit of poise... And it is heavier slightly. Um, but it does look cool. And the physical is so much better. And the poison resist and the bleed resist is way better. Is it all like that? 
but that's not it. Hang on, that's it. Oh my god, hang on. Oh! The Varangian armor doesn't have any poise. Oh. Hmm. I wonder if I should have a hodge... Okay, the helm of the Varangian armor is more physical defense, slightly less poise. This is less physical defense and less poise. There seems to be like a big old disparity between helm and armor for the Varangian set. What about the legs? Again? Okay, I'm, you know what? I'm going to keep what I've got on. Yeah. The helm is good, but all the other sh stuff is shit. Right. I think we're good to go. The binoculars won't help me in the fight against the three lanky streaks of piss. Um, but otherwise I'm good to go. Da -da 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 -da. I think a couple of people hinted at the fact that, you know that ca campfire I couldn't get to in the Lost Bastille? Apparently, um, I think you can get to it, and I just didn't find the, uh, the way. Um, and you know what? I had a thought that I might find Luca Teal. After the whole ghost ship thing went down, we never found Luca Teal. And I thought, you know what? Maybe after resting, she would appear in this sort of cell area. Because I never did give this place a proper good look after resting. Um, so let me just have a quick peek around. And I might use this opportunity to check out more of this area down there. And maybe get to the boss room this from this direction rather than the other way. Look at you. Copa. Copacabana. The hardest shit north of Havana. Hey. Right, there's no Luca Teal. Right, okay, let's do this. Oh, shall I practice the old... The old binoculars. <laughs> uh, f spell shooting. Oh my god, this is, this is going to be like a game changer. I'm not upset to learn this, by the way. Um. I will say, I've got some, like, expensive um, greater arrows on here, so every miss is like a... a pain. I mean, that was straight up a headshot. Oh, that didn't do shit. <laughs> that did nothing. Was I too far away? Uh. Oh. That's a two-shot kill. Huh, okay. I wonder if there's like a little effect where once they've been hit and taken damage, they can't take another hit for like a second or two. Because I didn't miss that follow-up shot, but it didn't do any damage. Ow! All right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Clearly I'm going to have to rest before I face the boss again. Jesus. Can I, uh... Ooh, you know, I think there's loads I haven't done around here. The campfire's around the back. I wonder if I can jump down to it. See, it's down there. I'm looking at it. Under my camera down there. That's the campfire. Oh, fuck. I'm moving and they're still hitting me. What a fantastic aim that fucker has. Copa. 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 Come on, camera. There. That's a campfire. Hmm. Well, hang on. Sorry, wasn't that all open around there? Or am I going ape shit? Let's kill this fucker. Sometimes fuckers have to die. Yes. Fuck you. Ooh. Right, I bet I can f jump down, I, I guess. Oh, I didn't miss that. Come on. <gasps> Oh my god, oh my god. Dogs, we've got dogs, we've got dogs, a thousand dogs. Fifteen thousand dogs. 
15,000 dogs. 15,000 dogs. 70 dogs. We've got 70 dogs. I got one. I got one, but I'm going to die. I am so dead. I'm fucked. In every way, I'm fucked. Just die. Die. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't think we'd lost any souls in the boss room at the end of the last episode, so I've got nothing to lose. So it doesn't matter. Shit, man. <laughs> I wasn't expecting the entire platform to fall down. Oh, bloody hell. I thought, right, we're going to do a nice, awesome landing attack on that guy. And all will be good with the world. <laughs> Fucking nope. Okay. Let's uh, practice this just a little bit more. Oh fuck, he's on my ass, isn't he? Ow, oh, fuck! Oh my god, right, okay, hang on. The, the... FUCKING HELL! You fucking psychopaths! Right, these guys are like, right, yeah, fuck you down there. These guys are just insane. You know what it is? It's the leading of the targets. They, they shoot where you're going, which doesn't help. Um, one, and then try follow up real quick. Yep, yeah, that worked brilliantly. Okay. Right, I missed the falling attack on this dude. If I can land it, it wouldn't be that big a deal. Um, I'm guessing he can't shoot up. Let's, uh... Oh, the, you can even step... Oh my god, you can even move, like, on the spot. That's crazy. Right, let's, um... Let's shoot the dog. And him. Fuck it. Kill them all. <laughs> it's just... Fuck them all. More dogs. Ooh, can I shoot the explosive barrel? Ooh, hang on. That's a... Will a certain number of attacks destroy it? Oh. Right, okay. I've got enough ability to kill the dogs. Well, why the f- Did my falling attack break the platform? Mmm. Come on, where's the dogs? More dogs. Holy sh- Holy shit! Is that p the pursuer behind me? Fuck! Right, okay, 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 it's all good, it's all good. Okay, can my light attacks aim at the enemy? Oh my god. <laughs> I just need to... Can I land an attack, please? Right. Talk about cobwebs. Oh, for fuck's sake. There. Okay, good. All good. That was the pursuer, right? I'm not going fucking mental. Where did he go? Oh, fuck! Where did he come from? <gasps> Bruh. I need to de-stress. That's what I need to do. Just, just de-stress. I'll lock on and just do it the good old-fashioned way. The good old-fashioned fashion way. There you go. There you go. Brilliant. Perfect. Textbook. Okay, let's just... Whew. Ain't no harm in taking a breather, am I right? Let's get the two souls that I dropped. That was definitely the pursuer. I guess he just pursues you, like literally, no matter what. I thought once I killed him in a in a given area, like I 
I actually killed him in the Lost Bastille. I figured, you know, once I kill him in this zone, he won't appear again in this zone, but other zones he will. Nope. Motherfucker just shows up. Right, okay, this is... Okay. So, I couldn't, uh... Can't get there. Well, can I... You can clearly jump on this little folly bit. A little window. Mmm. Okay, let's climb back up. Well, I'm curious. I'm sure a couple of people in the comments hinted uh, that I can get to this campfire, like, before I go through the three boss uh, sentinel area. Because previously I figured, well, we would just end up down there. After. Dealing with the boss and going through that shit up there. Oh, that's got to be the final boss in that tower. And judging by geography, I reckon the three sentinels are up in this tower right here. That kind of makes sense to me. It might even be that very building. Hmm, maybe I should just get back to the sentinels, I guess. Well, I can't figure out a way to get anywhere. Is it worth? Is it? No. Okay. 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 That's a big no. And there's no way across there, is there? Just jumping down from up there. Ew. No. I wonder if I can collapse that thing. Actually, let's try collapsing it. Ooh, I think you can. I think we're good. Yeah. Loot. Alluring skull. Huh. Okay. Well, let me take one last look at this whole area, then. There's no way anywhere. That's the thing I was trying to fall on, so it was through he here. If only I could see what was through that door, eh? Du, 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 du. Oh, fuck you up there. Right, I think we just gotta just get back onto the boss, I guess. Um, yeah. Sorry if I'm missing something obvious. Oh, fuck, what was that? Hang on. Well, I've, I need some flasks and shit. Uh, should I just try and kill the boss with three flasks? Oh, hang on. Hang on a second. That's an explosive barrel that he tosses at you. And that crack in the wall. Ooh. This has about a 10% chance of being successful, but can I get him to push a barrel at me? Why is he not, like, attacking me? What's the deal? Hello? Fuck! Okay, that didn't work. I, th I thought- I figured he would- Ah! I figured th he would roll a barrel at me. You know? That, that- that- that hole in the wall is too suspicious. I think I might be onto something. Um, I wonder if I- I wonder if I- can roll the barrel. If I just get him away, kill him. You know what? That sounds like a terrific idea. I'm too lazy. Let's home bone, refresh, and come back here, and we'll kill this dude without him hitting that barrel. Yeah. 
I think that 10% chance of it working has gone up to about a 40% chance. That so seems like what you gotta do. And this is gonna be awesome if this works. Uh. Oh, this, is p uh, this is a bit of a pain in the ass direction to come at it though, I'll be honest with you. Uh. I'll do it this one time. We'll just try and kill all these archer fuckers quickly. With wanton fury, just kill these fuckers. Yeah, that's one. Um. Well, hey. When in Rome. Fucking brilliant. Is the one down there? Yeah, okay. Dude. When in Rome. Whip out the binoculars and shoot someone. <laughs> That's what you do in Rome. <sighs> it can work fast if you start casting the spell before you're act aiming correctly, if you see what I'm saying. As long as you correct your aim before the spell releases. It's kind of all good. Can you hit with the... No, you can't hit with them. Okay. That would be great if you could actually straight up club someone with the, the binoculars. Here he is. Right, kill the dog first. Dog first before the pursuer comes out my ass. What the fuck was that? What the fuck did you just hit me then? One dead. That's fine. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Right, both dead. Very good. Okay, that was a weird death sound. I swear to God, every time I come down here, there's like an extra dog. There was like six dogs this time. <laughs> Fucking pursuer. Cast some sort of spell at me. Right, this is beyond a joke now. Let's refresh. Let's start from the other end of Lost Bastille. It's, I've got to get past one of those fireball simpletons, but it's still, it's fine. It's easier than going down through Archer and Pursuer hell. My health is getting shitter though. Let's have some balls and some... Uh, let's have some faith in myself. Let's go human. Uh, and I guess we'll heal. There. There we go. We've got faith in ourselves. Da, 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 the rings, da, da, da. all good. Right, okay, let's do this. Let's just go and kill this fool. Dude, it's been like 40 minutes or something, and I've literally accomplished nothing. Although, you know, I say that, I think I have figured out this. Oh shit, oh fuck, oh fuck. Kill him. You just have him. Just have him. If I die to this guy, I'm going to uninstall the game. <laughs> like, I'm done. Uh, okay. It's fine. It's all good. As long as this, the guy doesn't hit that barrel. Okay. Destroy these fucking barrels. Oh, God. I don't want him to accidentally, like, fireball a fucking barrel. Good enough, but I need to dodge the next attack. Very good. Nice. I'm hoping this guy isn't just going to hit the barrel no matter what. Um, in fact, <laughs> when in Rome, whip out the binoculars and shoot some shit. Um, I hope he doesn't react like start combat by hitting the barrel for some reason. Just please just come at me. Let's just go for this. Dude, this is so great. <sighs> yeah. Please tell me this is actual and interactable. <gasps> oh, right, I can just run at it. Okay, 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 okay. 
Okay. Let's kill the dogs. We're away, away from the barrel. In fact, I don't even have to hang on. Take a hit, it's fine. Just take the hits, take the hits. Don't hit the barrel. Don't fucking hit the barrel. Can I do the old roly-poly? Um... Now I do need to... I want to make sure this blows up. I don't think hitting it with a spell will blow it up. So I'm gonna heal to fall. Because I'm about to explode this shit. It worked! Nice! Yeah! Okay. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. Nice! Oh, thank god, that makes it so much easier. Hello? Oh! Was that- Okay, that was the swinging and missing I was hearing. Is this a blacksmith? Who's trying to hit an invisible anvil or some shit? Can I light this scunce? Wrong button. Hang on, are they, are they gonna be like dogs right here if I rest? <laughs> hmm. Okay, torch away. Okay, this has to be a friendly guy. Well, not before. I'm not, I'm not going to loot his tools or anything accidentally and piss him off. Let's speak to him. <laughs> Calm down, man. Oh, why can't they all be this easy? He must be a blacksmith. <laughs> he looks like a quintessential dwarven blacksmith. Mm. Mm. We've got a wild one here. Is he a man of the night's watch? Shabob, I say. He's got a northern accent, just like a, a man of the night's watch. <laughs> oh, <laughs> dear flame, how brightly you burn. <laughs> how brightly you burn. He definitely has, the, right, he's got all the tools of a blacksmith, etc. A bunch of chests, but he's not like a, a merchant. I can't, like, speak to him beyond some voice lines. Flame, flame. I smell flame upon you. I smell flame upon you. The blacksmith. Macduff. All I want is a little flame. Oh, right. well, I, I did light his... And that oh! The dull and ember. Now, you imbecile. He's a bit threatening but now. Right, yeah, the dull ember. I was told by Mr. Blacksmith number one that they can't use embers anymore. <laughs> Hey. What a marvelous ember. <laughs> I love his voice. Stones, I pray. Give me stones and I'll fortify your gear. He's got a creepy creepy voice, but I like it. It's basically from where I'm from, to that, that sort of accent. Give me your fucking stones. <laughs> okay. Steady hand Macduff. That, that's a fucking name. Infuse weapon. See, so the okay, so the blacksmith in Medulla was straight wrong, because he said we blacksmiths used to be able to use embers, but blah 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 blah. But you can. Cool. Ooh. Oh, something I thought I'd try as well. I've been talking about dual wielding or, or power wielding, whatever the term is, two halberds. But it crossed me. I could just practice with two lighter weapons because I probably have in just enough stats to, to do that. So I might try dual uh, power stancing, like a couple of basic foot soldier swords or something. Um, dude, I, I saw it as soon as I came onto this tab. Fucking katana. Bruh. That was like possibly one of my favorite weapons in the first game. And I got it like right at the end. I turned it into my plus 15 weapon and I barely used it. Because the Black Knight sword was so good, but, but, dude. <laughs> if I can get this nice and early in this game, go, like, more dex than strength, I might be onto something. Great sword, that sh I've already got a bastard sword and read it. 
Uchi Katana. A katana of unknown origin, crafted with a peculiar yet refined technique. The finely sharpened blade of a katana slices with unmistakable smoothness, but should be wielded with caution, as its delicate constitution means it's easily worn. Oh, does it break easy? Um, sorry, which one is fucking durability? There. 40. Does that improve? Because th that's a real limiting factor if you can only use it a little bit before you go to rest again. Hmm. 40 is like nothing compared to my Alberts. E B deck scaling. That's the best scaling I've seen yet. Great axe. Um, winged spear. Scythe. Mm. Longbow scales A with de uh, decks. Light crossbow and a royal kite shield. Nothing special about this. I've already got one of those. Well, I think I'm going to want to buy the katana at some point. I've got... Uh, I've got 15 decks. I only need one more dex to use that. And the longbow. Just one point of dex is nothing. Um, okay. Okay. Well, he also sells wood arrow, iron arrow, iron great arrow, wood bolt, and heavy bolt. And, oh, he sells the large shards. Oh my god. Okay. The first blacksmith only sold the small ones. Bruh. If those are unlimited. Uh. And I think they are. Because that doesn't have a white number on it. I've got three, it's held three, but that's just an unlimited number. That says one, so maybe you can only buy one powder, but unlimited shards. Don't need to repair. My halberd needs... Oh! I've actually got three shards. I can upgrade my halberd right fucking now. Mm. Oh, shit's getting interesting. Hmm. I'm going to stick with my Halberd for now, but th I'm so going to have a Dark Souls 1 moment in this game soon where I switch completely and realize actually the Halberd wasn't that good compared to some of the other shit. That moment is coming. I can feel it. Right, so we can infuse. It's my... I still don't actually have the strength requirement for this outside of dual wield um two handling. So this is to infuse, but but what's it doing? Select item to infuse. I'll click it because I don't think that's final. There we go. Um magic fire. Okay. Oh right, I see. You know what, this is actually straight away more intuitive than the first game. I didn't have too much trouble figuring out the first game, but you can just straight up see all your potential upgrades in this game. You couldn't in the first one. So that's cool. So you can do a basic magic, fire, lightning, dark, which is it's sounding very similar to occult, poison, bleed, raw, uh... What did Raw do in the first game? Um, didn't it raise the damage? Uh, oh, what the fuck was it? Damn it. Um, it didn't break. That was Crystal. It, the Crystal made it stronger, but but what, it wasn't repairable, and it eventually would break. Raw was... It greatly raised the damage, but you couldn't upgrade it, I want to say? Some, something like that. It, so it's better off the bat, but it's unupgradable. Or something like that. So it works well with like a, ma a magic hybrid build. Um, mm, I'll keep that in mind going forward. And enchanted. I can't remember the difference between magic and enchanted. Uh, I think enchanted is to magic. What? Uh... Cur not cursed, what the fuck uh, was it? Um, the th chaos. I think enchanted is to magic what chaos was to fire. <laughs> Something like that. I don't know what mundane is. 
and then you can revert it, it looks like, to back to normal. Okay, so you need any of these stones, and I don't have any. Um, faint stone, fire drake, bolt stone, dark, dark knight stone. Dude, dark is just straight up Batman's weapon. <laughs> Poison stone, bleed stone, raw stone, magic stone. So any stone, special sounding stone. Gotcha. Flame, dear, I give you my all. And you wavered and faltered. <laughs> From the start of time, Flame allowed man to flourish. And even now, he devises new fiery arts. But his reason makes him doubt Flame. And so, we waver and falter. I feel like there was... Th that little chunk of dialogue there was far more uh, important than just a basic line of dialogue. That was sort of telling. The entire world is, is based on fire. We know this. The power of flame. Power of the gods. In the end, it is all beyond our reach. Is it, though? So flame allures us, and we attempt to harness its power. It looks like you succeed, sir. Dear Flame. I'm tempted to go back and talk to the first blacksmith now. Just just tell him that he's, his work is like subpar. And, uh, <laughs> and tell him he's, he's got shit to learn from Steady Hand Macduff. Flame, right. Give you. <laughs> right. He's repeating himself. Okay. Well, I'll remember. If I'm buying anything, it's that Uchi Katana. It just is. One point of dex, nothing to me, but a, one point of dex is like 5,000 to level up now. That's 5,000. So, honestly, you know what gives you 10,000 souls? Exactly. Killing the fucking pursuer. Killing the fucking pursuer. Who's right out there. Let's loot his shit. If he's not upset with us. Arrow. I mean, we're straight up taking his stuff here. Ooh, free ammunition. Five basic shards, that's nice, actually. And two large shards, so I've now got five large shards. I'll tell you what, like I said, I I'm gonna... Flame, dear flame. He did mention more another ember there. As I said, I'm going to stick with the halberd just for now, but we're, we're on the cusp of changing weapon. But until then, I'm, I've got enough shit to upgrade the halberd one more time, and the souls, and then I've got two more large shards now, so I can up my spell thing. Huh. Up my spell thing. Although I don't... I could do that twice, actually, but I don't have the souls anymore. Do I have any souls items? I do! Oh shit! Because why not up my spell damage just a little bit? I ought to flame. Now that I can buy these if I need to. Fuck it. Yes! More damage please, sir! Um, I'm gonna do that again. Flame. I've got another souls items. To use. I'll just use one of them. When we get back to those three lanky streaks of piss in a, like in like seven hours, I I'm, I'm gonna kill them like they're nothing. Oh, I need right. I see. Okay. Shit. Well, let's rest. Oh, let's open the shortcut first. Oh, hang on, there's a, there's a... Okay. I wonder if there is a key you get at some point. Maybe after you complete the whole area that would have let you come here anyway. Just for those who didn't find the barrel technique. That must be true. It's fine, it's fine. 
Sidestep. Have I learned nothing? Sidestep the dogs. Sidestep the dogs. Let's just walk up to these fuckers. One dog is staring at me, technically. No, he's not. Sorry, he's looking the other way. It's fine. I, I don't mind healing once before the pursuer. If he's even there. Jeez. I also need to get better about being slightly further away when I fight, because I'm hitting them with the shit part of my weapon. I'm still human. Right, we're going to stay human. Am I kill the pursuer? Um. Da, 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 da. Am I kill the pursuer? I'm going to kill the three sentinels and everyone else. I need to get rid of these barrels though. And there is an archer around the right side. Barrel, you know, I'm gonna dodge the archer. Oh, he's a bit shit like. Oh, he got me. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm cursed, I'm cursed, I'm fucked, I'm dead. We're fucked, life over. That arch is a bit of a problem. It's fine, we've got this. I don't need to heal. I need to get further away though, so I'll do some damage for fuck's sake. That's better. Good, excellent. Oh, he got me! Oh. If, see, if I'd have run down that corridor, I might have got away with that. That was close. The tactic was good, but I, I hit a wall. <laughs> I hit a wall, and then I got walled. Okay. All good. All, all good, I just gotta kill some dogs again. I'm not human anymore, though. Oh, fuck's sake, hang on. I don't mind healing once, it's fine. Just come at me, for fuck's sake. Dog bastards. I'm gonna die here. Yeah. I'm gonna fucking die. Hang on, hang on, for fuck's sake. Come at me. You dog fuck. Right, heal. I can do- right, this time, I'm gonna make sure to kill those fuckers. The- the- the archer fuckers. And then it's fine. I've got the entire area to wander around. You- you know? Okay. Let's do the old. <laughs> this is such a good. This is such a good thing to do. Oh. I know it's a complete juxtaposition with the whole spoiler talk at the start. Like, I'm so glad this is now a part of my life. You know. I know it's it it's it's two opinions that just don't match each other that I have. Like for people to cool down on the tips just a little bit, but at the same time, I love this shit. You know what I mean? I don't know how to reconcile those two, di like, completely conflicted opinions that I have myself. Uh, there's no right answer, you know what I mean? It's like I don't want to be told the information, but at, at the same time, some of the information is just a fucking gold mine, right? He's here. Oh, he's not coming at me just yet. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Oh. Now hang on, if- right. Is he gone now? Uh, officially. The archer's there, that's fine. Is he just gone now, officially? I wonder if I leave the area, and then come back. Do you know what I mean? Just run away. Maybe he can only sprout from the ground like a flower. 
once per rest or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, that's a shame. Cause, right. Uh, okay. Well, you know what? It's, the dogs seem to give you a lot of souls because I've now got enough to just, at the very least, buy that katana. If nothing else. I can't wield it yet because I need the decks, but I don't care. Let's. Hello? I ought to fly. I ought to fetch a new ember. Right, okay, well. Okay. Let's just buy it. I'm taking the advice on board that, that scaling doesn't mean as much in this game. So as long as you can wield it successfully, it, it kind of doesn't matter. Um, you don't need to go balls deep into strength and dex for the damage. Let's buy it, and then I've got it forever. And I'll never have to think about it again. Cool. I might even be able to use a thing and then level up my dex once, actually. Some of these bosses, I'm telling you, fast attacks do work better. I noticed that with the, the curved sword that I had in the first game. It's weaker, yes, but sometimes fast attacks are just what you need. I've got enough to level up. Oh, I'll be right back, Mr. Pursuer. Mm. Monster finished. Okay, hello, lady. Bearer of the curse. Seek so, seek the king. Lest this land swallow you whole. People have warned me that this lady says some unique one-time-only stuff sometimes that's easy to miss. So going forward, I'm not going to insta-skip everything. I'm only going to skip a line of dialogue when I've seen the subtitle for it. Just so it's not a new line of dialogue that I would miss. Let's do this. Dex, 16. I need, like, half a soul. Are you kidding me? 23 souls. Piggies. Um, I need some ham. <laughs> now that there's, there's two big pigs, they give you, like, 150 souls, I think I saw. Something like that. Hello, piggies. Come to me, little piggies. Ow. At least they're just as weak as the first little pigs. There we go. Nice. Ooh. Somebody warned me as well. I think it was Mr. Lion. Good old helpful commenter Lion. Uh, who warned me that after I finish the Lost Bastille, I might have a... Uh, Bearer of the curse. Seek I might have a famous moment where you sort of feel lost, but but I already figured that Majula is the center of everywhere, so I'm just going to keep going every direction I can go from Majula. So I don't think I'll run into a dead end where I don't know where to go next. I, I know of three directions to go that require a, br a branch of yore, at the very least. Nice. Okay, I just have to do this. If it turns out that the katana feels excellent, to, like excellent to use, I might just have to say fuck the halberd immediately. Who doesn't love a good fucking... And it'll be lighter as well. You know, the durability thing actually isn't that big a deal. Because I'm liking so many other weapons, and I can wield them all. Dude, one-handed or two-handed. Let's, uh, let's test speed. One-handed. Oh, it's only a two combo. Okay, what about three? Uh, what about two-handing it? One, two, one, two. Right, there are no big combos in this game, then. Two is the maximum number of swinging, swingages. Power attack? Oh, the power attack is the same. Oh, it's... it's not. It is a two combo again, though. Uh, right, let me get the stamina back and let's hold it down and see what happens. 
Right, does require you press it again. Jumping attack. Ooh, a nice vertical slash, that's excellent. What about the kick thing? Shield break. Okay. Um, running attack. <gasps> Ooh, thrust. What about one-handed? Same. Right, okay. It seems like one and two-handing in this game is the exact same moveset. Whereas in the first game, it does change the moveset sometimes. Um, I'm wondering if there's any diff difference with, like, speed. Two-handed. Two is that faster with two hands? I I'm wondering if there's literally any bonus to two-handing or if I should just one-hand so I've always got my spells ready. Uh, it's a different sound, have you noticed? Let's, let's kill one pig with one hand, and then we'll kill the other one with two. I want to see the damages of a single hit. Oh, I've got a... sorry. <laughs> let's, uh... Let's revive the little piggies. If I can get a second katana... Uh... Let me know if, to power stance, it's got to be two identical weapons, or just two weapons of the same type. Because if it's identical, then I need a second Uchikitana. I'm, I'm guessing it's the same type, so two sword, great swords or two katanas. I wonder if you can power stance like shields, because you can wield some weird stuff in these games. And attack with them. Right, here we go. That's a uh, light attack. That's one, four, three. Hang on, get away. Get away. I don't want the damage number to stack, so let's confirm it's one, four, three. It is one, four, three. Okay. Wait for the number to disappear. One, seven, one. Okay, it does look. Hang on, that was more. Mm, 138 uh, didn't have enough health to test really it is it's more right I wonder if this the extra damage doesn't come f simply from the fact that you're two-handing but the strength increase from two-handing maybe it's as simple as that because it does have some strength like st uh, scaling a little bit well, two-handing is worth it, if I'm not going to do shit with my left hand anyway. Ooh. Oh my god. Um. Oh my god. How many things have I got? Can I can I upgrade this already? I knew you'd be around soon. I love the jump attack, and I love the running at thrust attack. Um. I've got five. I did loot five small shards, didn't I? I need more salt. I need more salt. I've got one more large thing. Oh no, I used it! Oh no! Oh, I can't waste those big ones. Fuck. Right, okay, well... You know... It's fine. Well, let's go kill the pursuer. Let's go kill a pursuit. Get 10,000, then I'm going to upgrade the shit out of the Uchi Katana. And it might then be my go-to weapon. Let's try killing the dogs with it. Because the best part about the Halberd is the, the, f the very first light attack is a vertical slam, which is just excellent for a first attack. A swipe isn't as good. Hang on, hang on, now let me let us this is a this is a stamina game. Come on. There we go. Jesus Christ. It's clearly weaker. It's it's weaker anyway, and it's not upgraded, so. I'm kinda not gonna I'm gonna ignore the damage, if that makes sense, for now. Because it's just not a fair comparison with the halberd. Calm down, calm down, sir. 
I just one shot kill that. Second off it. Right, these these little messages really are a fucking pain. It was like that in the first game. It's not easy to see for people who don't know this game too well. But when when you loot something, you are stuck. No matter how fast you get rid of the message, you've got like three seconds where you can't move or do anything. Even dodge. So you, I really need to stop looting in the middle of a fight. Uh, I might want to put the halberd back on. For, for this fucker. Because it's just got more damage, do you know what I mean? Far more damage. Let's not be a dick. Is he there? No, he's not. Okay. I'm guessing he'll appear when I get a little bit further into this area. I don't want to go further forward. It'll spawn Pursuer, and then if I move back, he despawns. But I want to kill that fucking dog. Come at me. There we go. There you go. Now, I wonder if I can just see this fucker that's up there. Before the pursuer goes apeshit. Perfect. Fucking hell! Oh, this is bad. Okay, let's, um, let's roll my way to victory. I've got this. More rolling, more barrel rolling. Oh, that was close, fuck. I need to get rid of that fucking barrel. I need to heal, so I'm going to wait for him to be really delayed again. Good enough. Good enough, but bad. Bad! Right, I think that's good. That's enough space to run around. Kind of. That was bad, but one th let's, let's just wait for him to be super delayed again. Good enough. Let's stam- oh, ooh, I can get in more than one attack. Let's not be a dick. This guy is my bitch, you're fucked, sir! No, you're f- ooh, ooh, ooh. Don't get fucking complacent. Say goodbye. How many souls? How many souls? Oh. I got, oh, I got a twinkling tie tonight. I didn't get as many souls that time. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Right, finally. We're, we're one hour and ten minutes in. And I've finally done something. <laughs> Just a, something small. Okay. Well, I've got enough souls. To, uh, to do some serious shit here. Um, I do need to visit the bathroom and I'm going to grab another drink. So, uh, two seconds. Right, I'm back again. Let us... To fetch a new let's immediately... So, you know, souls, like money, it comes and it goes. Shards, shards are another story, but you see what I'm trying to say. Let's just upgrade the fucking thing. Just because we can. Yes. Um. Plus two, right? So that's... Right now, so I've only upgraded it once. Haven't I? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I've only upgraded it once. I've got the souls, I just don't have the basic shards. I could go and buy- you know what? Sorry about the back and forward. 
At least we can travel nice and fast, you know? I need to buy the base, some basic shards now from uh, blacksmith number one. And real quick, let's just speak to him and see if he does have anything new to say. I knew you'd be around. Equipment can be strengthened with... My girl knows her stuff. Now, there's a time... Even you must have someone waiting. No, it doesn't have, have anything new really to say. Well, let's buy one more stone. I think he does have a limit though. Let's buy one. And then we'll reinforce the katana again. Yep. Oh, it's on to large shards. I could, I do have a large shard and I can buy more. My harbor's on plus six. Jesus. Well, you know. Oh, shit. It's, it goes up to a deck scaling after this next upgrade. I've got to. <laughs> I'm not going to do any more, though, because I don't want to spend all my souls uh, on just buying upgrade shards that you get by playing the game anyway. I'd prefer to actually level up at some point. So I'll save the next 4,000 souls. But at least we've upgraded a little bit. Ooh, I've even got a thing to use. Can I level up? No, shit. Okay. Well, I've got 5,000 souls to lose now, <laughs> which uh, isn't great. Mm. I'll tell you what, if I can get... if I've got to kill these dogs anyway. So, ironically, I've... Let's just kill the dogs. Kill the dogs, get enough souls to level once, and then we'll have nothing to lose. And then I'll do the three sentinels. It's all good, it's all good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, brilliant. That's not enough souls to level up just yet. <laughs> you know, if I kill this fucker up here. Um, right, can I actually aim a spell on the barrel and blow him up with it? You can. Oh, will, will it not explode? Oh, okay. Doesn't explode. Let's try the katana on this little guy. Oh, dude, he stumbled. Fuck! Oh my god. Just have him, have him. Right, they must be weak to slash or something, because he I was doing more damage than, with this than my halberd. Hmm... Right, we've, uh, we've got enough souls to level up. <laughs> Fuck me. Oh, I've got just, fucking just enough to level up. It's getting way more expensive every time, you know. Um, equip load. I've been thinking more and more, you know, the stamina is a, a real problem. Um, I think somebody said, oh, don't bother leveling up over a hundred, but because it barely goes up with each level, but the thing is, I'm right on a, a critical point here where doing, like, a full light attack combo, I'm just empty. If I had just a little smidgen bit more stamina, I'd be able to roll afterwards, and that makes all the difference in the world. Because I'm doing, like, all my light attacks, I'm out of stamina and can't roll, then I'm taking a hit. I might put a couple of points in stamina, um... Like when I get more souls, you know? That takes us from 100 to 102. And gives us poise. Um, I kind of want to get to like 110 stamina or something. And then I can really... It will open up a world to me. In my ability to, to get to safety after I've done damage. So I think it is very important. Right. Now's the time. Now's the fucking time. Finally. Um, I do think down here is the best way to get to that boss room. It's a bit of a pain. Shall I try katanaing them? I'm not gonna go. I was gonna go human and just just 
try my absolute best to do it in one go. But I don't want to do that. Well, I've taken damage already, but it's fine, it's fine. Just kill him. Right, okay. Can I get him to blow himself up, but like, go to safety? You know what I mean? Yes, I can! Oh, 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 fuck yourself. Dude, fuck me. And he's got, right, they've got no armor on their torso, I've noticed. It's like cloth. Right, and yeah, you know what? No, I'm going to go back to the halberd for the armored fuckers. I'm sure Slash is weak against armor specifically, so... Blow up! Yes! Ow, oh, it hurt me, but it did the job. You missed, sir. Let's running attack. Running attack! Oh, yes! Let's just heal. I'm gonna try to not take a single hit now before the boss. Um, and this is all the same old shit, so I'm gonna jump cut uh, to when I get to the boss room. Right, fuck me, I've just hit start recording. You don't know the difficulties I've had getting to this door. I've died nine! Count it, nine times before getting here. <laughs> Oh, God, no. Right. Uh, right, okay. Okay. I, I I kept dying so much that I had to stop the recording because I was filling up my hard drive so much. I'm going through hundreds of gigabytes of fucking file size here, so I had to stop recording before getting to the boss store. I died nine times trying to get there. The deaths kept getting increasingly bullshit. Like, to the point where, at one point, I just got fireballed around a corner by one of these fuckers. One-shot kill. My health is on half. I'm gonna have to go human. I've discovered one thing. I, I think I can get to the boss door without fighting any of them. And that's kind of what I've been trying to do. I didn't record any of it, but I was trying to figure out a way of, like, corralling them or getting them in one place so that they're easy to go around because my problem is once I go through that door that's being guarded by two of them there's that corridor and then three of them come at you through the corridor so you can't run otherwise you run straight into enemies and it's a tight corridor so I've come up with a little plan and I'm gonna go human I'm fucking confident in myself <laughs> despite what you just saw I've been, I've been literally trying to get to this boss room for like 40 minutes. <laughs> it's, it's stressing me out. But I've, I've figured out something. Once I pull the fuckers in that room, there's a big open room I can wander around in and corral them all in there and then, then I run past them. But even then I've got to sprint through like three of them. And my health was on like half going into that boss fight because I took a hit. And I was, like, cursed and shit. That was just never gonna work out. Um... Shall I try the katana just to get in some faster hits? Or shall I not bother? You know what? I didn't... I didn't upgrade that for no reason. And it's lighter, which can only help. Fuck it. Right, I am not going... To... Uh... I might be able to get past these dogs without them seeing me. Oh! Oh my god. I've killed that dog so many times it's ceased to spawn. Oh my god. That's how many times I've done this shit. That's fine. Now. Uh. Oh, hang on. I did have a method of killing those two fuckers. Fuck it. Let's just go. Fuck it. These two have killed me several times, you know. Depending on what move they decide to do. Right, fuck off. Jesus. <laughs> the fireball has exploded barrels a couple of times. And that's gone and fucked me. Right. I might be able to do this. Come on, stay away. I've got to be fast as shit here. Because they're behind me. Come on, open the door faster. Right. I need to pull those. Those are the ones that block you. Okay. Okay, okay. 
I've discovered that these guys, some of these guys, can reach you from such long ranges, it's ludicrous. I need to do more circles. This is not good enough yet. Not good enough yet. I'm nearly there. Do you see how ridiculous this is? Now I can run past them. I've taken some damage, though. But there's still more here. I've got to run past these three. Four. Sorry, there's four. There's four, not... I'll find a moment to heal, but Jesus Christ, you see what I'm dealing with trying to get through this shit every time. Any good damage? You know what? That's excellent for, for, for faster weapons. Ow. That's excellent. I'm going to try and dodge. I need to heal. Good enough time. Right. Okay, I've got five flasks. Oh, he's fallen down. Okay. Well, that's... Right. I'm, yep, I need to dodge. There you go. Ooh. It's less damage, but you know what? I just need to kill this fucker before his friends come. Right, that's the, okay. Okay. Um, right. Oh, they've got a, they've got quite a distance. Nah. Oh fuck. Previously, they were like. Oh, you see. Right. Okay. Let's go down. Now's the time. Now's the time to go down. Let's use a gem. Right, okay. We're doing good. I thought these guys, um, in the in the f last few days, I've been thinking to myself, once I get some distance, they do... They are quite slow, so if I can get some real distance in this motherfucker, I can cast spells for quite a while. I just don't, don't want them to do the whirly bird attack. I need to keep the camera on them or they're going to do some funky shit. I don't want them to be doing funky shit. Bad. That was my bad. I timed that all for sorts of wrong. I need to heal actually now. No! <laughs> okay. I'm actually going to kill a few of these ones. Lingering flame. What's that? Lingering flame? Lingering flame, can I get a lingering flame? Oh, I got a pyromancy! Huh? It needs two spell slots though, so that's not gonna be used. Okay. Right, I'll, I'll just keep the, keep the footage going this time. Yeah, I saw that coming. I, I, yeah. I didn't know what to do about it though. I was surprised by uh, how high, how high my damage was with this katana against the uh, boss, though. That's a good thing. Run like a maniac! Run like a maniac! Run like a maniac! Run like a maniac! There you go. I mean, as near full health as I give a fuck. Go 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 go. Same deal. Ow. Oh god, we're bad start. <laughs> I 
We're doing excellent. Right, it's fallen off. I'm going to use that opportunity to heal. See, the other, the other two haven't come at me yet. Oh, I thought I dodged that. Okay. You see, I don't know why they're not coming. Maybe I didn't get close enough to the edge. Bad. Oh, why do I suck? I'm going to heal again. Have they come at me yet? No, they haven't. Do I have to kill this one? I do. Right now, officially, they're on me. Okay. Oh, fuck. No, my... Th oh, that was... That was all sorts of fucked. Okay. The reason that jumping lunge slam keeps getting me is because I think, I keep thinking, mistakenly, blatantly, mistakenly, keep believing that I'm far enough away that it won't hit me. And it always fucking does. Right, I just want to point something out. I have now permanently killed one of the two big fucks. I killed the other one uh, and then just killed these two. But I've stopped one of the big fucks from spawning. And I'm just like thinking to myself, you know what? I actually kind of like that. I like the fact that you can sort of brute force clear your way back to a boss, if that makes sense. That's actually kind of cool. It's like a fail safe. If you, if it's like the game saying, if you keep failing like this basic bitch you are, fine, we'll take some of the mobs out of your path back to the boss door. It's like the game. Calling me a pussy bitch without actually calling me a pussy bitch. <laughs> it's fucking... It makes your job easier. The fact you can perma-clear it by just doing it enough. Right, I'm not going to do the same with these, though. I am going to just get them all down in here. Fuck it, I'll get an attacking or two. Why not? If I can just get them all in here. Right, okay. Basically full health. I haven't taken any damage this time. There. Right, if I hug the right wall, I can just get all around them all completely. Okay. It's starting to look up through brute force. Bad. I started to heal. This is getting to be a fucking pain. Am I just sucking? Uh, right, as you can- oh, hang on. I think it was the other one that permanently disappeared, so now- It was the other one that's permanently disappeared, not this one. So have they both- I'm not even gonna- I'm not even gonna jump cut back, you can watch this time. So that's two big fucks I've permanently cleared. What about these two? Are these still here? Right, okay. I'm grateful I no longer have to have two big fucks and two small fucks to run by. These smaller ones will still be here because I haven't cleared these enough times. But that's, uh... I've got positive and negative feelings about this, okay? It's positive I no longer have to deal with these scummy shits. But it's, it's almost like it's an official way of knowing that I've just sucked too hard until this point. <laughs> <laughs> you got to agree with me. I must be right. I, I definitely need to kill one without either of us falling down, though. That's the fucking problem. You know what? I'm going to do some damage to him while he's, while he's alone up here. I've got like a couple of seconds, you know, before his friend jumps up. I'm never going to lock on either. Right, I'm going to jump off now before I get attacked. Brilliant. Good. What the fuck? Why am I? Okay, 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 okay. Ah, fucking what the fuck? Multiple levels of what the fuck again?
do they just does this game like have some system where it's inventing new attacks based on what I choose to do? What the fuck was that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Have you ever seen the movie Kung Fu Hustle, right? <laughs> Re weird reference time. Kung Fu Hustle, that ending movie, the end of the movie when he becomes the fucking like son of god or some shit. He does that, he, he gets kicked up all the way into the clouds, then he comes back down, meteors back down to earth and like fucking palms the earth and fucks the bad guy up, right? That's what that thing just did to me. It just disappeared into the high fucking heavens and I was nuked. I was, I was accidentally... <laughs> I wasn't locked on when I started to try to cast a spell, so I tried to hit the lock on key, and that that yanked my camera to the sky where apparently the fucking dude was. So that wasn't a regular sort of jump slam hit. He just vanished. Is that something they only do when you're trying to spell cast? Because I haven't seen him do that yet. That was fucking unique. Fuck off, you little shit muncher. You piece of shit. Now I've lost some health for fuck's sake. It, it's my fault. Oh god, this is bad. I didn't realize they were that close to me. I shouldn't be taking any hits from these guys, though. That's my bad when I take some hits. Oh, I don't like them disappearing like that. Because now I'm like, fucking... Where is he? There you go. I shouldn't be taking any basic hits from these guys. See, that's all gravy. I need full stamina. Are these guys are just going to keep fucking falling down, man. <laughs> uh, at least his friends aren't trying to pop up. Very good. Gotcha. Jump up. They do go a bit fucking weird, don't they? It's not just me. I couldn't... I See, I had no stamina there. Having no stamina fucked me. I'm gonna jump down. That's that's why I was gonna jump down. Um, I can't do anything. Heal and then fall down, and, and now I'll heal again. I had no choice there. If I jumped down, I'd have died from fall damage. You know what? Right, hang on, hang on. Back off. Back the fuck off. Get my camera on them, so I'm not getting nuked from above. Me trying to spell cast is like getting me fucked here. Fucking hell! The spellcasting thing is sort of unnecessary in a way. But if I can get if I can get the odd cast in, that's what I care about. I want to be. I want them to. I want to bait them into doing basic close attacks rather than the whirly bird crazy attack. Do you see what I mean? You know, I think my my spell. Hey, at least being knocked down from the first one meant I didn't take the second one. All right. Come on, attack me. Basic light attacks, for fuck's sake. I don't want to start- I don't want to do a spell. Okay, that was the nuke attack. Did you see that? That was the nuke. 
<laughs> this fucking fight. I don't want to start doing a spell cast, is what I'm trying to say. Right, I've had to do that. Right, okay. I'm pre I'm, I'm like multitasking with my own controller for fuck's sake. Light attacks. Come on! I fucking hit the circle key! Is there like some delay on my fucking control that I'm not aware of? Fuck. Doing good. Sort of. Why did it... Right. I didn't cancel my lock on there. It just stopped doing it. What? I was locked on there, but it didn't cast the spell at the dude. What's going on here with my spell casting? It's, li it's like I'm losing the lock on. Okay. I need to kill the one with the shield first. He's the one with the low health. <gasps> Dude, did you see that? The shield blocked some of his... Some of the spell damage. There we go. Excellent. Excellent. You missed, bitch. You missed, bitch. You know, it's better to sprint from that fucking attack. Come on. No! I'm out of use! Oh, fuck, I'm out of fucking spells and shit. That's fine. One sword attack and that shield guy's fucked. That's it. This is it. This is the moment. Am I gonna capture it? Or am I gonna let it slip? <laughs> I feel like I'm losing myself. If you f catch my m and drift, okay? Fuck you for days. Fuck you. I will wipe my balls with you. I'm not even going to lock on because you're such a basic bitch. Katana for days, yeah? I think that meteor attack is basically like their thrust slam, but like on crack. Just, just a stronger version. Bad. Ooh, I was out of stamina then. I wonder if a jump attack will kill him, you know. It won't. It won't. I didn't have enough stamina. Ooh. Can I can I th lunging thrust attack this guy to kill him? Fuck you! You lanky streaks of piss! Yes! Yes! Ah. Oh. Primal happiness. Yes, I'm shit at the game. Yes, I'm a basic bitch. I'm probably more ape than human. I don't give a fuck. Yes! And 33,000 souls is no fucking joke either, by the way. I know, I know, all, all of you that have played Dark Souls 2, you're like, why is celebrating this? It's, it's some basic enemies. <clears throat> my, my, like, 25 deaths to, uh, on these guys and leading to these guys. <laughs> Do you understand what I'm saying? I don't, it doesn't matter that they're basic enemies. It was a fucking challenge for me. Me and my basic ass. Thank 
God. That shit's over. What's this? Interesting to know though that when they raised their shield, it was like actually like blocking ranged damage. Ooh, the katana, hey, it worked pretty well against those guys that looked kind of armored, so who knows. <laughs> Fuck yes, illusory wall. I just, you know what, that's a bit shocking because that didn't look any different to the other walls. If it wasn't clear, I was I was actually hitting the the X key. Are these all fucking what? Yeah, to be clear, I was pressing the X key as I was talking that whole time on every wall. Then I found that wall. Then I found that one. Oh my god! I'm finding illusory walls as I'm talking shit here. Is there some fucking telltale sign? Like, that wall has a line on it. I'm sure I just saw between the line. But that I doubt that's a wall. You see what I mean? That doesn't cross me. Like, there could even possibly be a, a door there because of that horizontal line. Is there a line on that? I think I can see a horizontal line there. I can see a line there. I can't see a line there. <laughs> okay. Might just be this room, but it's looking like no horizontal line means there's a door there. Dude, rusted coin. Yeah. Temporarily boosts luck. Crushing the coin temporarily boosts luck. This rusted coin gives you that little extra bit of luck, making items and the like easy to find. So is luck the item discovery stat of this game? Let me look at my stats. Unless there is no actual luck stat to, to see anywhere. Um, I certainly can't see any. That's how many souls I've spent or whatever. Required soul souls. Well, I can't see any. No, okay. Okay. It, it must just be more hidden in this game. Ah, uh, who needs messages when you've just got a an X key and a mentality of finding illusory walls? <laughs> horizontal lines. No horizontal line. Mm. I'm onto something. Whew. Target shield. Hang on, I'm pressing all sorts of the wrong shit here. Da -da 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 -da. Target shield. Small metal shield with protrusions. Small shields are very light and easy to. I am hearing some shit move here, by the way. Not very stable when attacked. The protrusions of the center of the shield are designed to brush attacks aside and make parrying easier. Ah. I've always wondered what the central little extra thing on some shields is for. It makes sense that it sort of sli it, it, it literally parries attacks easier. Like that little round thing on that shield. Sometimes it doesn't always just look to be like a centerpiece of a shield, but an actual functional thing. Oh, no, there's no horizontal line on that wall. Oh. Okay. 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 Any of these walls fucking fake? Oh, hello, ladder. Uh, I'm going to just take a little peek outside. Sorry, I'm doing one quick once over, over of every wall. Don't mind me. All the illusory walls in here weren't concrete. It was the opposite in the old man's wharf. Concrete was illusory walls. Here the concrete isn't, but the brick walls all are. 
But that's fine. Let's take a quick look outside before I climb the ladder. Right, some, something is trying to shoot me. I'm clicking on every motherfucking wall ever now. I'm never not clicking the X key. Oh, it's one of these fast fuckers. Oh, f if I died there. You know, I'm not going to take any chances. I'm going to fucking heal. With my last flask. I'm not being killed by some basic zombie bitch. I knew I heard someone. Jump at me, jump at me, jump at me. Oh, I'll have him, have him. I'm not losing 33,000 souls to some little shitty zombie. <laughs> Sorry about this shitty camera work. Am I, am I losing my shit here? Where is the one dude that was just chasing me? Already I've found more illusory walls in this game than all of Dark Souls 1, by the way. Right. Uh. Oh god. <laughs> oh god, help me. Jesus, take the wheel! Oh, thank god for that. Three bones, thank you. Walls. This is like a city of illusory fucking walls, man. Hush. Is that gonna... Is that gonna make my footsteps silent, perchance? I bet it is. Hush. Um... It's a sorcery. A sorcery that facilitates surreptitious activity reduces the sound made by its caster. I, I think I'm right. The eastern land of Mirach is not only the home of proud knights, there is also a there is also a traditional order of shadow knights who quietly carry out unspeakable tasks. AKA the eastern land of Mirach has like a thieves guild or some shit. The dark brotherhood. Okay. Well, I'm more of a warrior. I kind of want to make my presence known, to be quite honest. Unless I'm trying to, like, backstab or something. In which case, I'll just walk up uh, nice and quiet. Right, that ladder was just another way up here. I see. Okay. Well, I'm glad to see we got every single illusory wall. I'm just going to keep going forward. I'm I'm hoping there's a campfire ahead of us. So I don't have to backtrack. Rouge water. What the hell is rouge water? Rouge water. You know what amazes me? How many people mispronounce rogue and rouge? Just in case you didn't know. Let's, let's use this as an opportunity to have a little school lesson. Rogue is G-U-E. And rouge, like the colour red, is U-G-E. Hmm, anyway. So, restores HP and spell uses, so that's, uh... That's nice if you're a caster, especially. Cool. It's very quiet in here. Um, if y'all have got any feedback, by the way, for volumes, please let me know. I've been worried that a couple of my episodes have been a bit on the quiet side lately. Um, anywhere to jump? I think, kind of upsettingly, this is a dead end. I figured it would it would lead to the bridge kind of area. Oh, oh fuck! What the fuck did I just see? What the fuck did I just see? Oh, is it like draw distance or something?
I want this guy to come at me. I might have spell you. I might have spell uses, but I could drink that rouge water. I'm not losing 33,000 souls. Shall I backtrack now? Or shall I just keep going? You know, let's suck it up. I still have confidence in myself. Oh god. Fucking hell, what? Why? Why? When? Where? Oh my god. Hang on, bear with me. Uh, da, 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 two hours. How long have we got? Fuck me. Because of this this episode has been recorded in multiple parts, I have no record. I have no way of knowing how long I've been going. One hour and a half. About two hours. Let's go to the hour, hour and a half. We've got this. I don't know what the fuck exploded, by the way. Everyone chill, everyone calm down. Yes. Yes. Servant's quarters. Oh, cool. People have been reaffirming how this game, the difficulty is in multiple basic enemies and not bosses. Never has a truer word been spoken. Um, well, I'm going to spend these souls uh, before I do fucking anything else. <sighs> Let's go back to Medjula. I'd kind of like to complete all of the Lost Bastille today, if possible. I don't know what's in front of me, but uh. Bearer of the Kurt seeks. You know what? The king. Oh. That is the only. Make sure. This land make sure I'm not skipping. Home. Okay. Now I've got 33,000 souls, I've never been in a better position than to buy a branch of yore. And apparently they are so limited in this game, like, I knew you you've got to be careful or whatever, so I reckon I will have to buy a branch. I mean, I think you can only buy one, if that one is to be believed. So I'm going to buy that now, because I've got more than enough souls. Like, if I had only 12,000, it would be far more painful, but I've got 33,000. So I'm going to buy that one that's available, and then that's gone. Take these! Ooh! Covered silver sup ring plus one. <laughs> Is that because I've spent money with her? Oh, so she gives you... That guy sells you more shit... This guy, th this woman, just gives you free shit. Mm. I don't have that ring equipped. Um. So I've, I had the original, now I've got a plus one. That's 10% more souls. I bet this is 20% more souls. M maybe it goes up in five, maybe it's 15% more souls. Less durability and less weight than the first one? If I could plus one, it would have more durability. It's the same exact thing. Oh, I wonder if it's just lighter, maybe. And that's it. Either way, I'm sort of okay on souls. Let's, uh... I might want to consider upping the shit out of my katana. And I've got the souls to do that. It seems more useful to me than just leveling up, like, an upsettingly few amount of levels with that many souls. I bet I get, like, three levels out of that, if that. Maybe not even three. That's probably two levels. Whereas I could upgrade the shit out of my katana. Let's speak to, uh the blacksmith. Because I do need to buy large shards. <laughs> Probably a waste, but who cares. I to play. Okay. So, they did well in that fight. I want to keep going. I need two large shards. That's just fucking... Let's just put my money where my mouth is and buy two large shards. 
That's expensive, though. I'm not going to do that much. Now I need three more, but I'll get those naturally. Very good damage. Right. You know what? That should be perfectly enough souls to level up twice. I'm happy with my purchasing decisions. I got a branch of yore. I upgraded my sword a couple of times, and I'm gonna level a couple of times. Seek, seek the king, lest this la I reckon that's a good mix of things to spend my hard-earned winnings on. Um, I'm gonna do what I said before. I'm gonna up the stamina to a decent amount more and poise. I'm happy with that. The, the stamina is a real issue, so that's a real plus. Nice. Cool. Um, right, what's the soul item I've got? That won't, that's not enough for anything, so I'll save those two. And we're good. Let's go back. The order of the fires is interesting. Like, the very first one is, is last on the list. The newest one is middle. <laughs> Weird. Ah, Elizabeth Mushroom. Ooh, Elizabeth Mushroom is an item in this game. Elizabeth was the, the, the Lady Mushroom at the start of the DLC area in the first game. In the Artorius the Abyss Walker DLC. She's the, the Mushroom Lady. Huh. Anyway. Anything in here? Any illusory walls? <laughs> Can you blame me for trying? In fact, just uh, every few feet. <laughs> just, just. Um, I'm yet to find out uh, to figure out if I can move like this and just press quickly like this and it works, or if you've just got to stop and face an illusory wall. Because if you can, like, sprint and hit the key, that'll be great. Hmm. Well, let's just start opening doors and shit. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. We'll, um, we'll go down the ladder first. I reckon that'll be, like, a single room. <laughs> Because that looks like an important way to go out there. Very dark, very dark, very dark, very dark, and I'm fa I'm fighting the fucking pursuer. So dark, and I'm fighting the pursuer. Stamina, stamina, stamina. Ah, uh, you know, I'd be fucked without the Chloranthy ring. Because if... I'm thinking to myself, the stamina is so slow to recover, and that's with the Chloranthy ring. I've been spoiled. <laughs> Honestly, the more damage I do, the faster. Uh, the, f the, the more likely I am to kill him before he does that spell shit. Oh, he got me. Stamina. The stamina fucked me. Stamina fucked me. At least I had nothing to lose, really. It's all gravy. I mean, fucking hell, that's a very dark room, number one. And I'm, I could probably use a bright bug or something. But it's also a small room. If he does that dark spell, I'm kind of fucked. Look how- oh, there's a little Faris thing. I think I've got one stone. I love you- I love you can check your inventory on a ladder, that's great. Um, please tell me I've got one stone, otherwise, otherwise I'd have bought one from Lady. Um, fuck, I don't have any. Shit. Shit. I don't have any Faris lock stones. Okay, that's annoying. Maybe there's one in that chest. 
Let's get this shit nice and fast. I wonder- Oh, there's an item there. I wonder if I can just walk past that third attack there rather than having to roll and waste stamina. Fucking hell, dude. He's put right. He's he he is actually getting new moves every time, you know. I'm sure that sword is changing. <laughs> like it's going bright blue sometimes. I want to try doing. I haven't done a single. Oh fuck! Run around him in circles, in circles, in circles. Excellent. Excellent. I want full stamina, though, before I try doing any power attacks. Whoa, you crazy fuck! Um... Oh, you f fuck, man. I'm gonna heal to full. Fuck it. Heal to full. Yeah, no, he's getting more and more dangerous. Right, this is getting silly. I'll just kill him now. Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? That lunge into explosive barrels is so deadly. Oh, fuck off. Fuck you. I bet it's not even that many things either. Oh, 6,000. Um, is that 1,000 less than last time? I thought it was 7,000 last time. Mmm. Large club. Well, I've got two strike weapons now. I've got your morning star and I've got your club. Your club. I've got your, there it is. Large club. 180 strike damage. It's a great hammer as well. Or just a regular one. Hmm. Okay, please be a Ferris Lockstone. Please. Oh, I think chimes are uh, faith things, aren't they? Do do do, priest chime. Yes, it is. Let's read it. Sacred chime granted to high-ranking clerics. A catalyst from Drang Lake was the home of many clerics, but King Vendrick held a lukewarm opinion of their powers and kept them only as attendants to ceremony. In this sense, Drang Lake was not the place for a cleric with any ambition. Right, so... King Vendrick... gave zero fucks about the magic. Kinda like... all the kings of Skyrim... and their attitudes toward... towards magic and the College of Winterhold. No one, no one gave a fuck about magic in, the, in that universe. I see. I'm hoping there's a big final battle against the Pursuer, rather than he just keeps reoccurring for the entire game, and even after the end of the game. Okay. Okay, well, I'll remember that here. Ooh. I guess he just, just keeps coming, though, because I've already got his soul. And it feels like that would have been the final thing to get from his final form, you know? I could level up again if I wanted to. We'll keep going even with my 8,000... In fact, uh... I got another effigy, so... Fuck it. I've been on... I keep going... I keep topping up to 18 effigies. There we go. The human woman I was born to be. Yeah, as long as I'm replenishing my effigies, I don't care about just kind of wasting them and just exploring as a human. I get full health now. Yeah, fucker. 
power attacks, motherfucker. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. These guys are a three-shot kill with light attacks. And that fucks my stamina, so that's really good. Bastille Key. Oh. I wonder if that opens the blacksmith door, the door, you know what I mean? Open cells of the lost Bastille. Um, there were some cells in that weird corridor, but there was nothing there. There was one item and I looted it outside the cell. Hello? Dude. This, this, okay, Lost Bastille is actually officially... Is there an invisible motherfucking dragon? Where is he? I can hear wings and roaring. Where is he? Is he? I mean, I can't look up any higher than that, by the way. Unless... No. No, okay. Did, did I miss that, or was that just... Intentionally... Intentionally, you can't see him. I think this is connected. Hang on. Um, yeah, this place is way bigger than I thought. I kind of figured I'd be pretty much done after I killed the three lanky streaks of piss. I should have known. Let's go up the stairs. Fuck! You can you can hear now every time I hammer the uh, the uh, X key, looking for illusory walls. Right, destroy all these because I, otherwise they will kill my ass. Oh God! Don't don't do your belly flop. Don't do it. Fuck. <laughs> can you imagine? Belly flop. Nuke goes off. Wall, brick, concrete. I'm smelling an illusory wall somewhere. <laughs> I rolled! I promise you I rolled then. Rolling usually doesn't explode the barrels. That was weird. Yeah, I rolled. Game's lying to me. some pointless door action <laughs> that's a pointless door right there well I'll keep going and if this just keeps on going I'll uh, I guess I'll go back outside again oh, oh hang on the ones with the fire chest hang on some of those have like a light in their chest, and others don't. Hmm, I wonder if the ones with the lights have the ability to self-destruct like that first guy did. Huh. Okay. Hello? Hello. I see you. You old bastard. What is that fucking explosion attack? It's just a dead thing belly flopping. But Jesus is high damage. Oh. You little fucker.
Dude. One shot kill with my upgraded katana though. Illusory wall? No. No, 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 Climb. Okay. There's some weird, like, unnecessary <laughs> furnishings. Like, ladders that go literally nowhere. Etc. Dude, this place is fucking crazy. Hello. Green Blossom, thank you. Hey, I mean... With the sheer amount of fucking walls. Hope you guys won't hold it against me that I'm... I'm slow and I'm clicking on every wall. That's an elevator right there. Mmm. I'm only going to click wall, like, I'm not going to click a wall here, for example, halfway up a staircase, because there's not going to be an illusory wall, you know? I mean, hello there. Can I get him to explode his friend? Oh, come on. Come on, bruh. These guys like hiding. Oh, you can, uh, officially, you can roll to be immune to the explosion. Because I was too close then. Oh god, this place is reminding me of the, uh, Skeptic Spice. It's reminding me of, 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 uh, the, the trap house, the trap house in the first game. My brain is farting on the name of the place, but you know what I mean. It's just, it's just getting bigger and bigger, and more dangerous. Du, 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 du. What the fuck did I get? That. Skeptic Spice. Lowers the required faith by one for a chosen spell. Oh. Can I... Mm, I'm guessing that's a one-time use on any spell, rather than... Like, I mean, to permanently lower the faith requirement. That's interesting. Hmm. Oh! Oh, have we got a transport trap? I bet we do. Yes, we do. Hang on. Right, okay. Um. Let's have a look through all these doors and things before I commit. Well, I'm not going to go through the boss door just yet. Let's destroy these before he destroys me and these. Fuck! Where the fuck? Where the fuck? Where the fuck? He's still firing on me, that fucker, all the fucking way over there. Let's kill these basic bitches. Fuck! Oh, I see. I swear that guy's weapon just twitched on the floor. Scared me. Power attacks, motherfucker. No fire today. Twilight Herb. Right, motherfucker. Whoa! It, <sighs> ah! No, fuck it. Oh, what a legend this guy is. Rapid fire. Is this legless? <gasps> oh my god. I forgot you could sidestep. Oh my god, that makes this even better. You've got to really sidestep. Because shit curves after you.
I got him. I mean, I need, I need to get him again, but I got him. Fucking hell, the fucking... The fucking curve of those shots. Is ridiculous. Oh god, it's just his head showing for fuck's sake. Oh, that was nearly right. I need to aim up a little bit from where I am aiming. Oh, come on! That, that was a little bit bullshit, I think we can all agree. Let's just crossbow him. It's just easier. That was a little bullshit. Fuck me, you can sidestep with the crossbow. I did not know that. What the fuck?! Alright, I'm being bullshitted by the game environment. If he can fire at me... Right, that's... that's why he's not firing, it's like he's being blocked. I'm just gonna use all my arrows, I didn't give a fuck. Got him! Fuck you! <gasps> oh, you basic bitch. He's even throwing intentional curves in there now. I'm not even moving in this fucking curveball in it. What a legend. Oh, come on. Right, okay, this is clearly end fucking game here. Yeah? I might as well see if this is like a shortcut or whatever going down here. Oh, hello. I've got a sconce to light, I've got a fast... I wonder if this is just simply a fast travel thing. Oh, yes. You know, I had... Oh, hello. Ah! Ooh, okay. I had somebody... Sense Fortress! That's what it was called. <laughs> Yeah, I, I had a couple of people um, comment in the first game that uh, that they never knew that those uh, these cages were elevators, and I, I was shocked. Like, oh my god, you must have had a hell of a time traveling, like to and fro, without using those wilted dusk herb. Restores many spark. Yeah, it's nice. Oh hello. Oh god. Hello. Hello. Just ha hi. Just, just auto fucking terrified. Auto pants shit. Fuck! What the fuck? I think it's just the same fast ones that were down in Old Man's Wharf. I think it's a, I think we're all good. Jesus Christ. Don't judge me. Right. So, when it comes to light, this place is fucking terrifying. I saw that statue, by the way, and shit my pants. Um. Clearly, I don't have a torch right now. I've got bright bugs. Shall I try just tossing a bright bug? It's probably a waste right now, because there's no enemies or anything like a boss. But I've got... Oh. Right, I was confused. Right, I can light my torch. But then, do I have a bright bug as well? I do believe that's just simply... Um... A light you can throw down, basically. I don't think I have any. Mmm... No. Well, there was a, um, a thing to... A sconce back the other way. <sighs> Got another another Faris Luckstone. Well, I might as well just loot shit. Bone staff.
I could buy one Faris Lockstone from the old lady, but those I could only buy one, just like the um, branch of yore. Gotta loot the rest. Three weapons I've got to read. I'm hoping there are enough branches of yore and Faris Lockstones to get everything in one playthrough. I'm starting to get the feeling like... There aren't enough for everything, so you've got to choose which ones you want to unlock. And and that will suck if that's the case, because that means it you need to do new game pluses. To do everything. Hmm. Alright, well let's read some of those. Okay, parrying dagger. Unlike standard weapons, this dagger is intended for parrying. Hmm. Accomplishments are forever out of reach to those who constantly fear failure. A true warrior hones his body and mind and peers far beyond immediate hardship. I know that the translation, once you actually learn how to properly use this, you are an unstoppable killing machine. I get it, but I'm, I'm not willing. <laughs> nope. Da, 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 da. That's replay material, not blind playthrough material. Da, 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 da. I got like bone spear and other stuff. That twin blade, that's a new one. A twin blade fashioned from rare geist steel, designed for high ranking Drang Lake knights, hence the decorative design. Geist steel equipment is of the finest make, but geist steel is so rare that very few of these weapons were actually used in combat. Is that the same as this? No. I had something that was made of guy steel already. That. Ground Lance. Not much damage. Um, I'm going to equip it because I can't even see what it is. There's no clear indication of what it is. <gasps> Dude! It's, I feel, it's Darth Maul, but just like, ancient version rather than modern. Oh my god. You can guard with it. Fucking hell, can you imagine dual wielding these? Like, power stancing them. Right, so, both left things are just block. That's a light attack! Is it all one thing? You know, the follow-up is... Hmm. Power attack? Okay, this is some stylish shit right here. Dude, that's a... That's a power attack. Oh, The follow-up power attack is a slam. And all my stamina. Jump attack. And a running attack. Is that a running attack? Okay. Um, that's the light attack. I don't like that light attack. It's too slow to get going and hit things. Oh, I'm not... Right, hang on. Dude, I don't even have the requirement for... Two-handing it. What's the fucking requirement? 26 decks. Right, no wonder I can't use it well. So where's this bone spear? Ah, it's spell. Okay. Oh, hang on, that scales with A. Is that darkness? Right, my current one is C darkness. Okay. Requires 20 sorcery or whatever. Okay. A staff created with animal bones. A catalyst. Da, 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 da. Properly trained sorcerers receive their first staff from their master after reaching a certain level of accomplishment. Those without proper training must devise something of their own making. Like a bone staff. I really... I said this last episode. I wish you could see the original stats of an item. Because I've upgraded this like... Uh, four times. So I, I kind of wish I could see what the starting damage was. And compare it with this, you know? But there's no way of seeing. Hmm. Because that might be way stronger right off the bat. Okay. 
This was... Right, this was what's down here. Right, okay. Well, let's keep going. Can I look at this? Well, I've got the feeling the um, Ferris lock stone is going to turn off a trap that's going to kill me. So I need two more. Okay. Well, I might as well start, uh, you know, start doing this. That damage increase is fantastic, man. I could probably lock on to this guy, yeah. Okay, once I fall down, I can't jump up. Oh, I can, sorry. I can. Life jam. Just because I don't want to die. Back in your dogs. Get rid of these fast. Fast, fast, fast. Oh, it's... I think this is the outside that I could jump down to, I believe. Come on, doggy. Oh, hang on, hang on, back off. We've got two dogs. If you're going to make it that easy. Hello? Oh. Oh, these guys suck. I've been worrying for nothing over these guys. I need to watch my durability. It's getting down there. With the whole durability thing, this game really does kind of um, lean into upgrading multiple weapons. Because if this like nearly dies, I can just use the halberd and I'll still be happy. I'm a sidestep like a pro, sir. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> fuck's sake. Like a pro. No, no, shit, man. Okay, and that's just to get back in there. That's fine. Let's uh, let's do something. I'd like to do as much as possible before boss fog door. Well, there's there's an item. Can I uh? Yeah! <laughs> Fucking hell, let's, let's get the shit out of me, man. Wanderer ho hood, coat, manchettes, and boots. Manchettes. Let's read the manchettes. Wanderer, no poise. The, hat, the hats seem weird, like, compared to everything else's stats, if you see what I mean. Let's not read the, the, the hat to get a measure of a full set. Let's read the chest piece. See, this has, like, got more shit. This has got bleed resist, lightning resist, fire... Right, this is some magic resist shit, I think. A coat for the roving type. Light, sturdy leather made for long journeys. Look at the legs. Yeah, okay. Some, some resist shit. Okay. We've got a lit sconce here. And I can light my shit as well. Okay. Hello? Oh, hang on. Hold the phone. Hold the motherfucker. I've been here. I know exactly where I am. Oh, Jesus. 
Hang on, let's kill this fucker. This is the, um, the outside. Might as well just open it. This is where I fought the pursuer earlier. So I've already been in here. Um. Oh, fuck. Let's get us get my parents here. This was just loot, wasn't it? Yeah. I wonder if this door was locked from this side last time I came here, because I would have done any of this shit. You know? Unless I just sort of ran away and didn't realise. Um, any scones? I'm going to light my torch. I wonder if... You know what? Actually, I think I lit this. Thinking about it, because I know I lit the one in there. I must have been here already, didn't realise it was connected. You know? Um, but let's be fast. There is a sconce I want to Oh. Is my torch still lit? Yes, it is. Right, there's a sconce I actually do want to light. Um, back up the elevator, the fast travel elevator thing, so let's go. I am burning, ironically, burning torch time, though. What's up here? I don't want to have to put this shit away. Any sconces would be a real help. Where the fuck am I going? This is some terrifying shit, man. Okay, that's a drop-off. Oh. I know exactly where I am. That's that's where I've perma-killed those two big fucks. So it's just a shortcut back. Okay. Okay. I like it. I'm not the biggest fan of shortcuts that are one direction only shortcuts, if you see what I'm saying. I prefer but two ways, but uh, it's just a fast way of getting back there. Let's go fast. Fast, 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 fast. The sconce I want to light is up in this room, I think. And then we'll jump down and get that item that's there. Scones. There it is. And then we can put this shit away. Nice. Okay, how do we get that? Oh, the fuck. Do we get this without dying? Oh god. Is this a case of just Jesus take the wheel? Because you, you are stuck in that cage when you go down. Let's... Can I evaluate from down the stairs? Um... The, the, the lip is a bit awkward. No. Okay, I just had a big bang. Well, let's try. Let's lose my 15,000 souls. And try. You know, this second chain. Ah, it's a two-way system. Just like Sen's Fortress. That's, there'll be a second one, I bet. But I've only seen the left side. Hmm... Oh, God. Am I practice... Uh, when I roll, do I keep travelling horizontally or do I stop dead? Let's practice here. Right here. Right, you go straight down once the roll distance has finished. What about sprinting? And not jumping. Let's try sprinting. Oh, you do get some horizontal distance with the sprint only. All right. Okay. Jesus, take the wheel. Oh. Oh. 
bonfire aesthetic. Somebody mentioned that shit. Isn't that what makes it like plus one in a zone, like new game plus? Well, fuck that. Um. Although I wonder, even in a blind playthrough, it might be worth doing that to some of the earlier places, just to refight a boss again and get some more souls. If you want to farm souls, maybe. Like the last giant was easy as shit. Maybe I can make a new game plus last giant, just for fun. I can't believe I landed on that successfully. By the way, where do I go now? Riddle me that. Riddle me that right now. Oh. Oh my god. Oh lord Jesus. What the fuck am I looking at? Right, it's, it's the feet of this creepy dead thing. Fucking hell. Right, okay, well, I think we're good to go. I want to spend these cells and we'll go through that fog door. Um. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I'm trying to think if there's anywhere in Lost Bastille I haven't been yet. I'm going to head back to the roof where there was clearly some fucking loot out there. Because I know I haven't done everything out there. Back out this way. And short of this, I think we're pretty fucking good to go, kinda. Let's just flask. Let's not fuck around. This is not a game. This is a, a, a cock in the ass. Painful. Drawn out. But can be pleasurable, possibly, in the right circumstances. Okay? That's an awful metaphor. It makes no sense at all. It's not a cock in the ass, it's a, sl it's a, it's a punch to the balls. <laughs> it's a touch to the balls. Most of the time it's painful, sometimes it can be pleasurable. Oh, that's a better metaphor. It's a nondescript touch to the balls. I mean, what the fuck is this? Can I, can I officially get on this little spindle of wood without falling? Okay. Okay, I pressed the roll key instead of the jump, but it worked. Really? All that work? And this is just the thing that was already lit, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Where's this gonna go? I'm gonna stick with the katana, I think. For now. Just the f same with the queer like sword in the first game. You can't really beat the speed. The, the lower damage doesn't mean a lot in a boss fight. When you can stick the jab and, and move away easier. You know what? I'm going to try this fog door with two flasks. Or am I a fucking dick for doing that? I've got 15,000 souls and two flasks. Um. Fuck am I? Right, let's, let me just be clear about one thing, right? Where's the last campfire I stopped at? I think it's quite some fucking ways, isn't it? I'm struggling with where the... With all the shortcuts, where the hell the actual nearest fire is. If you see what I'm saying. Um, we can go down, but that's all the optional shit. But that does lead back to the... Forgive me. I'm going to spend the souls and level up twice, I think. But I need to figure out the nearest bonfire as well, because I'll respawn out all the enemies. So I need to know the way back. Let's just keep going backwards. Oh, right. 
Okay. All right. There is a big fuck on that bridge and the fucker that fires arrows before the fog door. Now that's a bit of a problem. But I reckon. I reckon, yeah. Oh, my hard drive is getting full. 52 minutes of recording time left. How long have I been going? One hour 18. Uh, da -da -da -da. Two hours, two and a half hours. Okay, let's, let's keep going while we can. I think I've got like half an hour left. Bearer of the... Seek so... Seek the... Lest this land... Yeah. Half an hour left, but that's enough to, to destroy a boss. I hope you'll forgive me again, but I, I, I'm tempted to put one more... I do want... I do want to get up to 110 stamina, like I said. I'm going to do it. Sorry if this feels like a waste, but as with going to, to 100 agility, I did that in one big go, so I never have to touch it again. I kind of feel the same with 110 stamina. I feel like that'll be good for me for a long time, and I never have to worry about endurance again. So I'm going to get to that. And now we've got nothing to lose, really. Um... You know what? J just to make sure I really have nothing to lose, I might spend all the remaining souls on basic shards. Just so I can upgrade more basic shit whenever I damn well please. That's it. Now I've got nothing to lose. I'll be around if you make it back. Because we, we will upgrade some other weapons at some point, so yeah. I'll need those shards. Um... Now, before this all goes down, I do remember somebody said, talk to this guy to learn the correct pronunciation of Heidi's Tower of Flame. You need my help, do you? I mean... Did you notice any letters on the ground on the way here? These are messages that have oh. jumped the fissures between Indrang Lake, yeah. the flow of time, okay. poignant wishes. Dash. Messages. Your will to soldier on falters. Yeah, okay. You may notice oh, these are, if he's you fear hollow. Summoning. Find summon signatures to call upon spirits to help you. Do you see the way beyond the bonfire? There was once a great you may just <sighs> don't venture too Heidi's Tower of Flame? Hades Tower of Flame Hades. beyond the far okay. the cathedral. The Apostles of Blue gather. But the road leading there is peril. The gate is rigged with but how it works. I've already been to Hyde's Hades Tower of Flame, and it leads you to Old Man's Wharf, and we've been through there. We've done all of that shit. May you find As far as I can tell, I'm done with that with Hades direction. Other than the one branch of your petrified statue. The letters are worn beyond recognition. Oh, I'm offline, so what's my death counter? <laughs> Fuck it. I don't know if that's good or not, but... I don't think it is. Right, I've got nothing to lose. We are human. We've got full health. We've got no souls to lose. Never has the time been better. I've got a nice fast weapon with decent high damage. I've got all my sorceries. Um, I'd like to not have to heal before I get to the fog door, though. So I might have to kill a few dudes, you know? I don't want to get to that bridge. Oh. Oh, let's kill this guy. No! Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> My life ring can heal that damage, that's fine. Dude. Okay. Come on then, come on then. Oh, 
Oh, he blew up. Okay. Oh, so fine with me. Fine with me, bitch. That should be three more. Alright, one's gonna do the explosion. That's fine. Oh, I thought I, do oh, I, thought I rolled away pretty successfully there. <laughs> that would have killed me. That would have fucking killed me. Oh my god. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Just can't let them box me in or whatever. Did you gonna jump down? Jump. We're nearly there. All is right with the world. I might be able to snipe those fuckers from here. With just a crossbow, because I want to save the spells of the boss. All good. Ah, I've got this. Um... I could AFK for like six minutes, but I can't be bothered. Um, let's equip some basic gems that I've lost there. I've got 27 of the fucking things. Because I forgot to add them back to my thing. Let's use one of those. That's fucking great! Jesus. Right, uh... Uh, I might, you know, I might be able to get away with this. Oh, pff. it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Right, this guy needs him to come at me. Fuck! Oh, fuck! Where the fuck? He must have come from around the side there. I really don't want to use it. Um, I'm going to just crossbow him, honestly. Oh, am I ever out of ammo? Oh, I might be out of ammo. This is such a waste, I know, but just forgive me. I don't. I can't be asked killing the guy up there when I can just go through the fog door. But I do need to kill this fuck. That was no damage at all. Oh! Right, when I'm close enough... There, when I'm close enough, he can't see me. Okay. Let's do this. Spells at the ready. Get some distance and learn the initial attacks. Oh. Okay. Well, I thought it'd be a boss boss room, I'll be honest with you. Oh fuck. But hey, progress is progress. Is progress is progress. So, let's just make more progress. Maybe we're still on the way to a boss door, you know? Dude. Yep, I saw that coming, getting boxed in. Uh, no comments. You suck, sir. That's my comment. you you basic bitch right so this goes oh probably up but it might go down as well so does this go anywhere oh another effigy nice 
Okay. I do have a ladder. Let's see where this goes. Down, you little bastard. Oh my god, that goes far down. I, okay, let's go up first. <laughs> hmm. What the fuck is going on with my graphics? Lacerating knife times five. That'll be a throwing knife. Okay. Um. Ooh, who's this? Luca Teal! Luca Teal summon again? Oh, hang on, I don't... Um, let's go... Okay. Okay. I think after we summoned Luca Teal for that boss down in No Man's Wharf, that'd kind of be it. You know, kind of be it. And then I'd speak to them again and their quest line would be over. I didn't realize I'd be summoning them at Lucatiel for multiple bosses. And I will I will do that because I'm invested in Lucatiel's quest line more than any other. But I don't want to summon her in an unknown area. If I can, I'm going to clear the whole thing until the fog dawn then and maybe I'll summon her. I'm glad I came back up here. It wasn't a dragon that I heard before. It was some winged harpies. We've got a couple of sconces we can light if we're fast. Now, hang on. We've got some loot up here. Yeah, okay. Okay. What the fuck? Harpies. Queen of the harpies. Were they, like, going to do a bombing run or something on this bridge? Like, what, what's the deal? Nice. Um, I don't care about 4,000 souls particularly. Um, let's just... You know what, let's rest. I'm going to respawn shit. Because the last time I rested was at Medulla or something. Oh, it's the fucking archer. You little bastard. Fuck you. Um, let's kill the couple of... Um, let's light the torch. I need to go down the elevator without losing my torch. <laughs> that means running past some fuckers, I think. Maybe. Or does it? Let's try getting on that thing faster shit. Faster shit, boy, faster shit. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> and once we light this, I've got light forever. Yeah. I almost wish these counted as a bonfire. As as that, there's too many in the game for it to be a, like a full blown rest spot. But you know, it kind of be a, an extra reason to light a sconce that you can make your own mini campfire. Maybe somewhere where you could officially rest but not fast travel. You know, some something like that, some middle ground. Right. I'm worried shit's gonna kick off here. Which is why I haven't summoned Lucatiel right off the bat. Oh, fuck it. I'm seeing blades in the night. I'm seeing blades. Is that a reflection? Is that a ghost? I'm not summoning Lucatiel to this. Can you come in here? Or is he too big? You're too big. Oh fuck. Alright, hang on. I'm mm, I'm conflicted. I feel like Lucatiel might be summoned for this thing. 
This is a twin, um... This is the same as the fucker we fought in the ship. He's, like, got two halves to his body. But then you've got a fog door. Is, is she here for the fog door or for him? And if she dies, she fucking dies. Like, that's it. She's dead. And that's at the end of her thing, so... She might get fucked by this thing. I'm tempted to summon her. I think she's here for this guy, not the fog door. You know what? Sometimes you gotta you gotta take the bull by the dick. We're taking the bull by the dick. I've got a feeling that thing might may have just died. <laughs> Um, we've just got to go ape shit. She's like, a, she can tank, right? And then I can just go full ham, swinging away from behind. Teamwork. I am slow in the water. Blossom. Oh, wait, no, that thing is here. Fucking hell. Full stamina, full stamina, just get full stamina. I'm doing good, I'm doing more damage than he's doing. Got him, right, let's heal. And then Luca Teal should heal. That, that thing was tougher than the boss down in Old Man's Wharf. Because of the spinny fucking thing. I wonder if there's multiple of these. Is the health going up? It's not. Well, that's a problem. I might have to go even more ham. The, pr the previous NPC I summoned that I didn't know the name of actually did heal at some point. Um... But Luca Teal isn't healing. I can't, like, force feed her a life gem, can I? No, there's no co-op healing. So she just doesn't heal. Straight up. Although she would do it, she would have done it already. I don't know if I like that. Okay, she, she's lost, I'd say, a good third. Maybe a tiny smidge under a third. So maybe I could get... Maybe I've got another couple I could kill. You know? Before she dies. But that, that was... I, I'm not comfortable with that amount of health loss with one enemy. Or maybe they, they only heal under half health or something. I'm just taking this one step at a time to see if there's any movement. I don't want to be fighting like two of these fuckers at once. Um, let's get up. Let's get out of the water where we can move nice and fast. Come on, Luke Steele, up here. Um... A lowering skull. There's another summon sign. What's that about? Who's this? Se I don't give a fuck about cell sword, Lewitt. Fuck you. Okay. Um. Let's cross over here. I wish I had the rusted iron ring from the first gun. Fucking dark. The one good thing about really dark places... <sighs> Ignore it. Pretend I didn't say that. Is that one of those guys who'll get pissed off? I can loot that later for fuck's sake. I can see a boss door and I want to get there in one piece with Luca Teal. 
Got a thing. Bastille key. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, fuck it. You just chill. Okay. Fuck me, man. Fuck! Now, man! He killed me, he fucking fucked Luca Deal up! Oh, why did I come in there? Hade Spear. Okay. Oh, God, pl please tell me she heals at some point. I am uneasy, to say the least. So once again, this is just some other dude. Honestly, I'm. T uh, I'd be. Uh, I'd be tempted to summon that guy just to help protect Luca Teal. But then I've got a feeling that you might only be able to have one summon active, so it might replace Luca Teal. That's fine. I need to be so fucking careful. Right. Okay. Um. She gonna follow me? Is she gonna disappear? I'm just worried something bad's gonna happen, and I'm gonna, she's gonna disappear or not follow me anymore. Okay, I've got a sconce we can light. Don't care. Let's do this. Please, please don't get sucked into the abyss by some sea monster. Am I an idiot for just going for this balls deep? I've got souls to lose. There's doors to open. It's now or never. Oh shit. Oh, Luca Teal's fucking dead. She's fu so fucking dead. Ugh. Okay, this guy's got a massive sword and he's fucking enormous. Luca Teal is dead. <laughs> She's dead. I've just got to try and go full ham here. Luca Teal, take your time getting into the fight, man. Oh, this guy's fast as shit. Why is she not fighting? Why is she not fighting? That seems bugged to me. Anyone else agree? Don't die, look to no. What what could I do about it? Do you know what I mean? If the NPC doesn't heal, what could I do about it? That's such a shame. That's a fucking shame. Ah, I'm not happy there. Um. All right. Soul of the Lost Sinner. Well, I killed the Lost Sinner. Pa partially by myself, can I Can I just add? So, that was not a complete cheese fest. But if, like I suspect, she's now dead and her quest line is over, I'm really not happy with that. Uh, I need some positive feedback to make me feel less shit about that, please, in the comments. <laughs> I feel like that wasn't my fault. She stood there, not doing anything, take... Did you see, like, she took f two full-blown combo attacks? That's like s six hits or something. 
before she even started to be animated and move and join in the fight. That seemed almost like a bug. It has to be. She was literally stood at the entrance, taking hit after hit after hit. And then I was just having to go absolute full ham to do any damage to the boss. To have any chance of killing him before she died. And even going full ham, I couldn't do enough damage that fast. I'll, uh... I'll rest at the fire before anything else. So is she just... I mean, maybe a phantom dying doesn't mean actual death. Maybe? Maybe the phantom dying isn't enough for her to die. Or something. Let's try and look at any silver lining. Ooh, a branch. And a mushroom. Let's just latch on to any posit positivity I can imagine, or find, or think of. A, prim a primal bonfire was rekindled. Is that going to be a, a light on the map in the mansion? Oh, hang on, hang on. No, 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 no. I didn't see, I didn't see the prompt. Fuck. Um, I'll speak, I'll save my talking for later. Oh, hang on. Uh, this is kind of fine, but I'm above where I want it to be. Can you fast travel to... No, you can't. It, right, that fire wasn't a returnable fire. Okay, so I've just got to go back from here. That's fine. Yeah, it's fine. I'm just going to run onto the elevator. <coughs> if it's there, I did write it down. It might be the bottom. No, it... Yes, okay, let's kill everything. Professionally dispatched. I am so upset, you've no idea. I'm bad. <laughs> Is she just dead? What what an unceremonious end to like an interesting little side story. Side quest, whatever whatever you want to call it. Just a little I've got a side character with an interesting backstory. She's like cursed and she's finding redemption and of trying to find a cure or find some hope and she just dies unceremoniously to what I describe as bullshit. It, if when you go through that fog door she would just be normal and be on attack mode, I reckon I'd have killed the boss quite easily before she died. But she just stood there and took the fucking hits. Please tell me that big fucking thing. He is back, isn't he? Oh, fuck off. That's not fair. That's not fair, man. Dude. Oh, my God. Please don't let me lose 46,000 souls and Luca Teal dies and I've got to end the episode. I can't, I can't end that negative. I, I, it, it can't be so. It can't be so. We've got to stop that from happening. I try to keep going up and just keep and, and go forward. You, you see what I'm saying? But I got blocked on that floppy little bastard under the water that I couldn't even see. So I'll go left this time. I don't think there's a corpse on the left. Maybe there's a way of resurrecting uh, I don't know, or something. But even, the, even if you can, 
the quest line might be kind of fucked, you know, or something, just because they died. Let's just hope. That's all we can do. Hope and not die. I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal. I'm not dying to that spinny fucker. Whew. I'm not. Sure, I'm not sure how long this episode's gonna be. It might be really, really long. Might even be really short. Attack me if you will, it's all good. Right, I got my I got my shit. That's fine. Let's go up and go down. And go all around. I'm hoping that can't follow me. Just fuck off. Leave me alone for fuck's sake. Oh fuck. Oh, it's a regular shit muncher, that's fine. I wonder if you can light your bonfire. Uh, sorry, light your torch off the special primal bonfire. Mm. Right, what's this? Radiant life gem. Or I wish at the very least he healing or using a life gem would also heal your summoned partner or, or, or something. Ooh, this key goes everywhere. Um. Ooh, a smooth silky stone. What is this? R river of blood? Interesting place. But the fact that you can't heal them, the fact that they can't even heal themselves, and the fact that they kind of bug out when you go through a fog door and they don't really join in, that's a recipe for completely failing to keep them alive. Oh well. Let's hope there's some magic resurrection stone somewhere. The creepiest thing about that dude was the, the creepy crawly crawling in his eye socket. No bueno. There's no hidden walls, is there? It's funny, you know, I think I might miss some stuff behind me. Um, Is it worth going back? Yeah, you can't rest here. Uh, I'm gonna go back. The under- the- the ground floor, I skipped. If you see what I'm saying. Cause that spinny fuck was after me. So I'm probably missing some loot. If spinny fucker is like on my side now, fuck it. Fuck! Hello. Calm down, sir. Let's just jump down and try. Check all the shit out. Okay, rolling is... Right, okay. There is loot, by the way. I've seen it. Okay. Um, oh, God. I need to remedy this shit. And be done with this place forever. The problem is... I've now got to get past the big spinny fucker again. Maybe I should have just gone to spend my souls while I still had a chance and come back later. I'm too stupid to do that. Hey, 
whatever works. Oh shit, yeah. Ha. Okay. The, the spinny fucker is kind of easy enough to walk away from, even when you're slow. You know, that is... Do I have a ring that lets you be faster when you're in water? I don't think I do yet. Because that is such a recipe for death. Three explodey guys. You can't see when they're on the, f like, below waist height, so you can't accurately time your roll away. And you can't even get away anyway. Because I think their explosion is just area damage that you can't roll from. <sighs> what a difficult section of game. I'm gonna try and go up. And just lose this guy. Let's go outside and lose him. And then we'll come back. Yes, there he is. Hello, you little shit muncher. Fuck you. Okay. I think I want to grab those 47,000 souls, like, before anything else. <sighs> Can somebody please let me know what attack that is? They just seem to, like, belly flop softly, but it's the force of a dying star exploding. <laughs> Dangerous focus! Right. That's it. I'm, I'm safe no matter what now. That's it. I'm safe no matter what. We're all safe. All good. All good. All good. Charge! Just get the loot. Farris Lockstone! Oh, that was worth it. Um, I can fast travel to a, to a closer bonfire. I'm not going back again. Oh. Oh, right. Well, that would have made it easy. Oh, fuck. Lit- uh, Lit- Right, okay, there, there is no iframes for that belly flop. <gasps> the fucking lock on. I don't even. <laughs> I don't even need to lock on. Ooh, yes. What should I spend these souls on? Is the real question. Um, there was two more rooms, so the last call for loot checks. You know what I'm saying? Just nothing. Last room, and then I'm never coming back again, except to light the sconce at some point in the distant future, maybe. I could light my torch off that one over there to light this one, but I don't care enough, frankly. Let's get out of here. Oh. I do need to end the episode soon, though. Not sure what to make of these little things on either side. Strange. Ooh! It's a... Is this like officially meant to be nighttime or something then? Uh. Okay. I came the wrong way. <laughs> Let's uh, use the far side fast travel super bonfire. I'll check out the mansion and then we'll end the episode. But I would like to use that Pharos Lockstone in one of the places, if possible, before I end, you know? Okay. And you know what? Let's use these souls before I just keep running around like a headless chicken. Let's speak to people and so on.
You have acquired the soul of an old one. I have. That is more than most undead can say. Those who come to drag, it happens to them all. That bloom, although he does off. Perhaps he is a foreshadow. Okay, sa same shit. Okay. Okay. Well, I mean, I could... Let's look at this shop lady. Maybe she got more shit for me. Since I've got so many souls. You would... Now's kind of the time to spend it on unique stuff, you know? Traveling merchant. Hmm. I can buy effigies. Can't buy no more pharos. Can't buy no more branches. Don't particularly care about the heal yet. I'll check. Uh, times these are. I'll check this dude. And I might even speak to Cat Woman. I'm glad to see. Buy item shields. Penal mask. That's new. Penal. Mask of the Lost Sin. I think people did comment saying this guy sells boss armor. And yeah, multiple people tell me to speak to this guy with zero souls. I keep forgetting every time I die. <laughs> Mask of the Lost Sinner. That's the guy we killed then. It was the Sin something tower. And that looks like the mask he wore. Lost Sinner. It looks like that was one of your main four bosses. The spikes pointing in would suggest in would that suggests this was not only used to bind prisoners. Is that like an Iron Maiden mask? Ooh, effect! Raises his equipment load. Or Oh, you can't see how much it does it by. Dude. Okay, that's that's some unique shit. I haven't seen any other effects on anything yet. That's the first proper effect. Well, yeah, I might want to be putting some masks on then, like separate of the rest of the armor set. Straight jacket of the lost sinner. So he was like a crazy person <laughs> uh, who murdered my friend Luca too. A tightly cinched belt pressed against the waist. By now, no one knows who this was used to punish or for what reason. Penal handcuffs effect raises power of pyromancy's hand restraints. A device used to restrict use of the hands. By now, no one knew. Yeah. Skirt worn by the lost sinner. A tattered skirt that the guilty wear in shame. So only the hands and the face have an effect. But that, that is fantastic. It's got five poise. That's what I'm wearing right now. And that's got um, six poise. Right, okay. Okay. Well, I don't mind one less poise. That's... Um, that top one, just physical. Right, physical, strike slash thrust, okay. Um, it's got 65 physical. My, ooh! Oh, it's got way more physical protection, and basically the same poise. It's got, like, special resistances as well. It's got petrifying curse. It's got some petrifying a shitload of curse resist and more poison and bleed resist. Fire lightning 33, 17, 13. Oh dude, it's got all of every resistance more. More magical, more physical, and equip load specialty. My current helmet is 4.5 in weight. That's slightly heavier, but it gives me equip load. Controller died. Fuck. <laughs> there we go. I think that's worth it. It's better in every respect, except minus one poise. And the extra weight doesn't mean shit, hopefully, once I have that equip load effect. So that's, uh... Fuck off, controller. Fuck. Jesus. Yes. I've, I've got the souls from the motherfucker to buy his shit. I don't care about the pyromancies for now. I think I'm not going to go pyromancy in this game. As fun as it was in the first game. Just because I know it scales with... Uh, fucking hell. G-Don controller. 
The battery in this controller is like permanently fucked. It's it. I don't even get three hours and it's dead from a full charge. Is there a way of like replacing the actual battery in it, or is my controller just fucked forever? I considered returning to my. I started to turn. Out. I think you should stay, my friend. I considered returning. You've got more and more good shit. So, was any other stuff from a boss then? The Elite Knight stuff appeared after I just spent some money with them. Royal Soldier... Mm, no, I think... Falconer... No, this is the first boss gear he's got. Mm, very good, well thank you very much sir. <laughs> thank you. 7,000 souls, bargain. Right, we're on 67 percent uh, equip load. Ah, of course, that's light. The katana is lighter than the halberd. Okay, 67 percent. 67 percent. Basically, no change. That's interesting. The equip load effect definitely, like. It, it cancels out the extra weight you get from wearing it, and adds a little bit extra. Um, it's hard to tell. I was already at 67, now I'm heavier and I'm at 66.9, so... It's, yeah, it makes up for itself. And then you get all the defense as well. Nice, okay. Oh, okay, we look like a bit of a gimp. I look like the mummy in the... Um... It's, I think it might be The Mummy Returns or the third Mummy film with Brendan Fraser where he's on that train and he's got that black mask on. It looks exactly like that. I did prefer the look of the other one. But you can't argue with effects, can you? Right. Let's level up. Bearer of the... Seek, seek the king, lest this land... Something seek, seek, lest. <laughs> right, okay. Here we go. Stamina's done for now. Adaptability's done for now. Health... Might be worth it, actually, for a little bit. Um... I'm tempted to start going balls deep in decks. Just for... Um... Yeah. More weapons, more cool weapons seem to be decks-based. Uh, magic goes up. Hmm. Oh god, I don't know. Fuck it out, I've got a lot of leveling. Okay. Right, okay. Are y'all gonna. I kind of want my vigor to match my endurance now, just from an aesthetic uh, standpoint. Not even the health it gives me. I want to be 15 and 15. And that gives me a nice chunk of health. So I can survive more shit. I can survive more belly... Right now, two belly flops from those zombies kills me. Because it takes me just under half health from full. That's not going to happen anymore. Now I can. Now it takes three belly flops to kill me. Yeah. And I'm going to go human. For no real reason. I've not spent everything. I, I didn't put one level up into anything just because, just in case I want to buy something, you know? Let's speak to Cat Lady and also go to Map Room. Uh, and then what else? Was there something else I wanted to do in Lost Bastille? Uh, oh, Faris Lockstone. And then we're done. Cat. You've been sleeping this whole time, you lazy shit. Oh. <laughs> no. You do have a rough time. Still talking about my smell. Okay. Same rings. Yeah. Nothing suits. You've got a shit shop, cat. I'm not impressed. Oh, that's dismaying. Let's uh <laughs> let's kill the old beefy boys again. Oh, I've just noticed upon killing Mr. Piggy, 
When you do the running attack with a katana, the follow-up light attack is fast as hell. Watch this. Right, I'll do the running attack. You can get straight into light attacks very fast. That's amazing for opening combat. Mm. Cool. Okay, map. Two lights, two lights. Yes. Even more flames have appeared. Yes, sir. I don't know what causes it. Ooh. Well, I, I mean, my guy could just tell him, but hey. But there is something greatly comforting about that flame. I'm cleansing the land. It to fulfill something very precious. Deep within the soul. Something essential. I would not venture. It was blocked by a wall, but it was crumbling. Right, he's repeating himself now. Okay. So that must... That must mean I've killed two of the big bosses then. One was finished after I killed the last giant. And then one was finished after killing the lost sinner. Is that two of the four major bosses? Let's check his little study room out. Anything new in here? No? Okay. Okay. Well, I think I'm pretty much good to go. I've got a branch of your. Haven't I? One? Oh, I've got two! Right, I was gonna say. If I had one, then I definitely think I should be unlocking Scotland's uh, thing rather than doing like an optional one. Mm, but I've got two. I will definitely save one of those to go to the Scottish one. Um, any upgrading I want to do? I think I'm good. I think I'm just going to level up again, actually, you know. Bearer of the seat, lest this land. Yeah. Let's put a point in Dex. Let's make everyone happy. Get some damage. Yeah. Right, let's go back to Lost Bastille. Uh, I want th that one. Let me know in the. I mean, feel free to let me know. I, I guess in the comments, um, since I'm asking directly. Uh, let me know if Lucatiel is just completely screwed now and, and just dead, because I failed. The thing was down here, wasn't it? One of the two Faris locks stands. Um, hang on, there was, there's been two. One's down here. Where was the first one? Um, shit. It's too much, it's too much to remember. Um, wasn't one in here somewhere? Oh fuck, I'm, I've completely forgot, I think. Wasn't there one somewhere? Fine. Fine. Miss my attack. What the fuck is that attack? <laughs> right. Okay, all's good. I don't think there's one in here. Let's just... I'll double check, though. I'll double check with a professional leap. No, okay. I guess let's just go down here. Because one is down here. Hoping pursued. Oh yeah, right. This is the first. Sorry, this is the first one. And the second one was in the other dark room. Let's just do this one. Yeah. 
Please give me something awesome. Something worth it. Yeah. Belfry Luna. Let's just give it a good old once over. I feel like I can hear a campfire. Okay, okay, hang on, calm down, calm down. We've got some toy soldiers. Hello? I'll fuck you up, bitch. I'm not gonna- I'm, I wasn't planning on touching your bell, sir. A long, long, long Who's this princess? The princess should me. Yes, just like so. Hmm. To guard this bell for the prince's honor. Stay away, foul and dead. Stay back! <laughs> <laughs> okay. For the prince. Oh shit! Abandon your covenant and join the Bell Keeper Covenant. I don't really care about my covenant covenant, and somebody confirmed that there's no real downsides. Let's join the let's be a bell. Let's be a bell end. Unnecessary joke. It's not a bell end, it's a bell keeper. Let's be a bell keeper. When the bell's in trouble. Alright. Okay, calm down, sir. <laughs> okay, what was that? Did us get a ring? I think each covenant gives you a ring. They both have so far. That was from the blue ones. So the blue one increases HP. This one. Join this covenant and wear this ring to be automatically summoned to the world of an invader of the Bell Keeper's domain. Well, I'm not doing that. Fuck that. So when a bad guy comes in here and kills this imp, I'll be summoned. I'm not wearing that shit. Oh. Alkan is Princess, Ven is Prince. Okay, okay. Right, so in Alkan you've got the Bell of the Princess, and that's what this guy's defending, but then you've got the Bell of the Prince. What's with all the dead little keepers? Is this symbolizing all the players that have killed this poor guy? <laughs> Hmm. Well, I'm not going to touch a bell, just for now, though this guy will be upset. But I want to see the bell. So this Pharisee- ah! I'm not touching a bell! Masterless Glencore, that's the last guy I summoned. Hang on, hang on, I'm being, I'm being invaded by all sorts of shit. Uh, hang on. Is this little fucker- Ow! Is this little fucker the guy that's inv just invaded me? Or was that the big tall fucker that I just saw? I'm getting mixed messages here, but either way, I'm gonna kill this fucking thing. Fuck you! I'm on the side of the bell ends. Why is the little imp killing me? Yeah, Masterless Glencore is the guy I summoned that then killed all those silver silver knights outside of the Dragon Rider's house. What is with all these fuckers? Fuck it, kill them all. I'm in no mood to be imped to death. Mmm. Fog door you can't get through. 
Do I have to ring the bell? Oh, hello. This is some weird shit. This seems like a semi- Fucking hell! This is like a semi-PVP covenant. Ah, that's the invader, right? He's gonna be more dangerous than the rest. Ow! Oh, he does seem a bit shit. Let's spell some fuckers. Oh, I hit him. Right, I can't do the range because I'm getting fucking slapped by arrows here. I just need to melee them. Fuck! Uh, why didn't my attack hit him? All oh, these little bastards. I find it odd that I'm being defended against here, like I'm interfering with this magical bell. I didn't see what that was. But I, I haven't said I'm going to threaten any bell. Ow! Right, I'm going to get let them come to my corner. Why? Why the fuck are my attacks not hitting them? I'm getting seriously fucked. Ow. Every fucking corner I'm going around, I'm getting fucked. I can't. No, no, no. Okay, no. Officially, I'm not doing the magic because I'm getting fucked. Dodge and weave. Dodge and weave. That's another one dead. Um. Oh my god. I'm trying to thin out the fucking herd, but I'm getting, like, fucked. <laughs> I'm getting fucked. Oh! oh, oh, these guys' arrows are really fast. Have you noticed? Very good. Very good. You fuckers! You little impish shits! Fuck, man! Right, I've got- I'm, I'm down to life gems here. I'm out of flasks. Right, fuck right, I'm gonna I'm gonna slaughter every single little fuck. You suck. I'm gonna kill them all. I swore to serve the bell, and these guys are killing me anyway. Fuck the bell. I'm gonna destroy the bells. I'm gonna kill the princess and the prince. How about how about that? Bell keeping bullshit. Human effigy. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna loot all your stuff as well. What's this? Radiant gem herbs. Right. This is a bell tower. Can I shoot the bell? <laughs> I'll hit the lever. Fuck it. I. <laughs> Fuck the bell ends. <laughs> giggle, giggle. There we go. Oh, hang on. If I was online and I fuck with the bell, could I then be invaded by Bellkeeper? I bet I could then be invaded by Bellkeeper um, Covenant online players. Good thing I'm not online, eh? Is that this thing opening? It is. Right, I've got no fuck. <laughs> fuck it. I've got no health. Oh, fuck no. Is this the exact same as the first game? It's a single... It's a single, um, health bar, unlike Dark Souls 1. Where the two gargoyles are, uh... You missed. 
wonder how well I can long range these guys. Oh, right, okay. They, they hit you when they jump over you. Understood. There's fucking three. We've got fucking three. Honestly, they don't seem as dangerous as the uh, ones in the first game. Even though there's three of them. Yes, they do. They're just as dangerous. Kind of. I've nearly fucked that one up. In fact, I have him. I have him. I've killed one. Fuck. Oh, hang on. Do you have to kill all of these? Fuck. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. This is ridiculous. You've got to kill every fuck. What is this? What optional shit is this? I'm doing good for having no fucking health. Do I want to waste my flasks? I really don't think I stand a chance in this fight. I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to waste point, you know, radiant gems. Okay. Well, there's something beyond this, th these fuckers. There's like another door. I'm intrigued. We're gonna, I, I don't have time for this, this episode. In fact, I've got to end the episode right now. Because disc full in approximately three minutes. So let's rest. I didn't lose much that I care about. Good progress. Um... Really upset about Luca Teal dying and potentially ruining that little side story. But if if that is the case, then it is what it is. You know, it's a blind playthrough and anything kind of goes. So it's part of the package, you know? And if Dark Souls 1 teaches you anything, it's that the, the Dark Souls is all about tragedy and misery and pain and every, everyone dying all light in the universe fading. <laughs> Everything's fucking misery. So, it, hey, it fits in line with all the storytelling so far. Um, but maybe there is some sort of redemption. Maybe Luca Teal's not dead. You know? Maybe? Either way, thanks for joining me for this episode. Hope you've enjoyed it. Th th this has been a brutal one, man. Like, Jesus. We started off stressful and getting wrecked by the three slimy fuckers. I then died a thousand times on the way back to the three slimy fuckers. Although you didn't see most of those deaths. But we triumphed. We killed the three fuckers. And then we killed the lost sinner. We, we lost Luca Tear. It's almost, it's almost like I've written my own story in her dying. We, we, we went through this journey, me and Luca Teal, and, uh, and she fell at the last hurdle. She gave her life. I'm gonna think, I'm, I'm choosing to think of it like I've written my own story. She, she gave her life and she died so that we could bring down the lost sinner. And now I'm wearing his face. <laughs> and, uh, and she'll be with me in heart and soul and memory, okay? Like this video if you liked it, like this video if you didn't like it, and subscribe for similar content. All my social media links are in the description, and I have a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content. I'll catch you guys in the next episode, where I guess we try... I think I can kill those fuckers. They seem quite slow and stupid. They are not as dangerous as the gargoyles on the roof in Dark Souls 1. They were way stronger. And bigger, like bigger range and reach, etc. These guys are stupid. But you do have to kill like six of them. I reckon I've got the power and the ability to kill those. 
and then uh, see what's at the at the top of the tower. You know, fuck the little imp impy bastards, <laughs> killing me and shit, and fuck the gargoyles. Next episode, we'll fuck the gargoyles. Liquid Blitz, out. <laughs> <laughs>